peace and grand rising to the sovereign original indigenous natural divine heirs. Today is January the 22nd, 1442 on the ancient moon calendar, 1443 on the ancient sun calendar, and 2023 on the Greco-Roman calendar. All rise and stand and remain standing into perpetuity. This is a sovereign living ancient article three. Moorish American Al Moroccan court action. We are the sovereign living justices, and I am Pauline Denise Ritchie. My free chosen sovereign appellation is Light Tajiri Bay. All are in capitis diminution nolo in red ink, in propia persona su juris, in propio solo, and in propio heredes. All Moors are the original indigenous sovereign ancient Al Moroccan Moorish American ascendants of the great pharaohs of Kemet and of the ancient Moabites and Canaanites our full faith and trust, our allegiance and our credit are hereby uh, vested in ourselves. Our trust is vested in ourselves as well. Uh, Just one moment. Oh, for we are the people who are the original indigenous natural design sovereign ancient empire state from Morocco. We're the de jure Moorish National Republic federal government. We are Washington District for Columbia. We are the Universal Moorish American Consulate and the Article III Moorish American Consular Court. Today, we are executing and exercising the law by our sovereign capacity, which is the original indigenous, natural divine, sovereign, ancient Article III, living United States District for Columbia Court. And we are the sovereign fiduciaries, creditors, executors, trustees, ministers, possessors, and entitled beneficiaries in this cause for action. We are peace, we are one nation, one state, one empire, and one God. We hereby accept our sovereign ascension, issue a universal creditor's bill for possession and custody over all judgment debtors. We exercise all sovereign rights at this time and at all points in time, nunc pro tunc. And we want to first acknowledge um, all of those who are participating in our 40-day national fast. We started our fast on December 21st, and it, it will culminate on January 31st. And we have just taken this time to abstain from consuming the flesh and blood of land animals to celebrate our knowing that we have never left our land. We've always been here on the land, and we will always be on the land. Uh, With that being stated, the land animals are are simply those that have walked on the land, chickens, turkeys, um, cows, pigs, et cetera, et cetera. We're abstaining from from those for for this time. With that being stated, uh, Justice Howard. Yes, Islam, Islam. Islam. This, This poem came to me early this morning. I'm not a poet, but it just came out of my head, so I wrote it. It's entitled, From the Patriarchs to the Matriarchs. Thank thy mothers, brothers. I am born from her. I am beside her, with her, holding her her rod and her staff. How many packs a day do you smoke there, buddy? One moment. How many packs a day do you smoke, buddy? Is that weed? Just a moment. Go ahead, brother. (laughs) I'll just just start over. Okay. It's entitled, From the Patriarchs to the Matriarchs. Thank thy mothers, brothers. I am born from her, beside her, with her, holding her rod and her staff to protect her from her mathematics she has stored upon us. Your son's cup runneth over from her supreme knowledge, from her mind college. Go out and cover the land, your vast lands. Be strong with your tan hands. She produced the supreme God man. She cools us while we sweat, cosmic with her cosmic hands. We work upon the lands. We restore the lands with strong man and clans. Restore your clans, man. Clean up your lands. Islam. Ooh, Ray Bond has got some strong hands. That's beautiful. Very beautiful. It's long. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. Empresses, don't we thank him for that? That's beautiful. Yes, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Gratitude. Thank you.
Thank you, Noble. That was beautiful. Very Thank beautiful. You. Islam. 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 Howard. Howard yes. introduced the sister like our sister that we met today on the call. Yes, sister so Kim. So she can give the demonstration. Thank you, Noble. Yes, Sister Kim Key, she's in Missouri Territory. Islam, thank you for being here, uh, Sister Kim Key. We are so honored that you're here as well. Thank you for being here. Thank you. Thank you for the poem, brother. Yes, indeed. 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 Islam, this is Karima Bay of Virginia. Uh, Noble, are you going to uh, put that on your website or post that somewhere so we can actually see the words and keep it for our records? Yeah. Thank you. I wanted to say that. <laughs> I can. I can. Uh, Dawood is assisting me with some structuring. So I'm a student right now. Welcome to the cult, okay. Nene Rose. And, and, Welcome uh, to the cult. Sure Welcome to Pauline's cult. Just a moment. Welcome to Pauline's Land Rover cult. Just a moment. Let me Let me make sure I know where that is. I want to make sure. Okay. Um, yes, we, Sister Light. yes, indeed. Sister Kempke is going to give the, her analysis of the demonstration she did using the Red Lobster coupon okay. that you put out. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. How you doing this evening? We are so honored, Sister Kempke, that Empress Kempke, that you are here. Thank, Thank you. you for being here. So what happened was <clears throat> when um, Mr. Rayford L. gave me the coupon, I went to the uh, place to make copies. So mm -hmm. um, I did enter Red Lobster, and I sat down, and um, I she asked us what did we want to drink. And I said, give me a Pepsi soda. And so when I um, gave her that, uh, I asked her, uh, do you guys honor this coupon? And she said, uh, let me see. Uh, let me take it back to my manager. I said, so she took it back there and she came back and, and asked us what did we want to eat. So um, she, on the table, it was a thing of what you can get off that coupon. So I think it's four things. It was the pasta, the fettuccine pasta, mm -hmm. uh, hamburger, french fries, um, shrimp, uh, a shrimp thing, and a, um, fish and chips. So I got the fish and chips. Mm -hmm. So after I, I ordered that, she came back up and she says, okay, uh, we're going to take your coupon. I said, okay. But she did say um, on there, she says, um, we never seen this before. And I said, well, on in the right-hand corner, it has national coupon in it. So uh, your corporate office would understand what to do with it. Yeah. So um, once I told her that, and I told her also, if you read on the back, it says uh, the United States Treasury is going to take her uh, the fees, and they're going to pay the gratuities, and they're going to pay um, for um, uh, the taxes on there. Mm -hmm. And she said, oh, I don't think they're going to give me the gratuities. I said, well, they will if you ask for it. Yeah. So I told her, put in your demand for for your um you know, your fees that yeah. you're asking for because she was serving two people. Mm -hmm. So, but um, on Monday and Tuesday, like Tuesday, you can go back and take two people on that same coupon, so which is nice. What territory are you at, Empress? I'm in uh, Missouri. Beautiful, 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 yes. So uh, they are all aware that as of January 19th, which was this past Thursday, that... Uh, that other thing, you know, the, that whole corporate thing is, is no more. They, they, they don't have anything else to give. So the national government, which is who we are, does have priority. So we, you know, uh, we have to actually issue as many programs as we can, uh, that being one of them. So we appreciate you sharing that information. Um, 
we just need more more mores to demonstrate that. Islam, you know? I'm over here shouting. Oh yes. my goodness, I'm, this is Angel, Empress Angel, Angel Bay, and so I am in gratitude to your demonstration, Empress. Thank you so I, much I for that. Yes, Empress, Empress Kim Key. Thank yes. you. Yes, thank you and, so and much. Later on that evening, um, my girlfriend, she got the coupon, and she went, and the manager was there, and he looked at the coupon, he said, oh, we don't think we take this. And I told her, I said, put him on the phone. Yeah. I said, yeah. you you have to honor the national coupon. Yeah. I said, your corporate office. And he said, I'll, I'm going to take care of it. You know, he gave them their food free. Yeah. So they were good. I yeah. must ask, though, <laughs> did either any of you have your national ID presented with that or no? No, I didn't use any ID or anything. Yeah, they probably and didn't. Mom, and then oh. um, it was two pages, so I put the the uh, second page on the back of that page. So mm -hmm. you can do that when you print it. Beautiful. That is Thank amazing. You so Thank you so much. Wow. Uh, and you know, it, Empress, how long? Let me just ask you just a question or two. How long have you known about more science? Um, I just known about it when Mr. Rayford told me about it. So okay. You know what? I we're just so honored that you're here because I I want to make this point to the Moors who 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 are on these calls and who are hearing these congressional assemblies go forth on the public record. The new Moors are going to come in and they're going to sit them other ones in the back if they don't get up and demonstrate. <laughs> Look, I'll be glad to on test. it. <laughs> I'll be glad to test anything that you have out there. Yes. Yeah it to me because I'm going to make them stand down and accept yeah. what is supposed to be accepted. Well, you know, Empress, they, they, don't, they don't really have a choice. If they want to continue to, to support their families and things, they're going to have to honor the status of the Moors. They have to. Mm -hmm. That's everything that they have, all the way down to the socks came from our vast estate and listen we're not we're not we're not even doing ego tripping and things like that it those are the facts and you know we honor the work that they've been doing it's work not service it's work right we honor the work that they've been doing and we want to continue to honor that we're not you know we're putting things in so that they can get a little piece like they've been doing off right. the, you know off of us we're not we really nothing. We really haven't changed things that much. It's just that we know now that everyone was getting their benefits from us. Mm -hmm. That's the only difference. Yeah. You know, so thank you for that, Empress Kim Key, because, uh, you know, the new wars are, are, are coming gangbusters, okay? All right. <laughs> And, and they're going to do what they're going to demonstrate their status, and they are not afraid at all. Not afraid at all, and they will stand. They will okay. stand. Yeah. I sure and, appreciate that coupon. Up. Thank you. Uh, thank you so much, and thank you for sharing that because uh, I will say this: you know, we don't uh, we don't always hear the successes because people just assume the successes are there. So mm -hmm. it's good to hear them. Uh, and that's one of the reasons we have this call to this uh, Congressional Assembly also is to hear from one another, right. you know, good or bad. And it tells us there's nothing bad. There's nothing bad because even, you know, when we're demonstrating and the demonstration goes in a direction that we may not have been think, expecting it to go, we're still prepared for that because the law does not change. It's not going to change. That mm -hmm. Constitution is going to be exactly what we put on the public record. So for Mother's Day, you guys take everybody out. Enjoy. Yeah, Islam, Islam indeed. Wow. Thank you for that. Uh, we have so many other programs that we're going to be putting on the public record because everyone on our land needs to needs to be able to sustain themselves and it not be such a stressful thing. The land is being is being returned to what it was when everyone wanted to come here in the first place, and so. That is what the national programs are all about. These national programs have the books. It's just that no one was. 
And so we had to lay the groundwork for them to be out. The trust between us and our subjects on this landmass is where everything comes together. So, you know, the managers, uh, not the managers, because we're the managers too, the subjects in our offices know to go ahead and honor. And more, if you have someone saying, oh, you know, I don't think we honor this here, tell them to call, call, their, call their corporate office, call their corporate office and, 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 and deal with it. And we don't argue with anybody. We're not going to argue because this is a peaceful transition. It's a peaceful transition. And Empress Kimke, I'm glad that, that, that your report is what it is, that you handled the situation firmly, but it didn't turn into an argument or anything. You no. know, when we have the right, uh, the right energy, the demonstration yeah. is going to work because it's the law, you know. It's the law. And what we do is we present the, cu- the, the, the national coupon first before we eat. Because that's just how we do, so that they already know ahead of time that this is what this is what it is, and, and, and it's honored. Our status is honored on the land because Moors, uh, and the Moors that are on this call who ha- who have been on the calls, who've been voting these programs in, we appreciate and thank you, and send the highest honors, because it's through that process that things work. And see, you know, program, the memory is coming back to our subjects of, of, of what the National Treasury is all about. And now, more as we have, we have interest in what we're doing from more as who are highly, they, they, they know that corporate structure, but they also are realizing that the public treasury and the public is where they want to bring their talent and their gifting. You know, um, we have so many things, so many programs coming up that it's just because they, the, the, the subjects have already announced that they don't have anything further, you know, as of January 19th. And we knew they were going to say that. And that's why the ancestors said, go ahead and put these things out, put these things together. And that Moore's, is why uh uh just one moment yes we'll 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 open the meeting uh taking a look in the chat um so you know Morris, it was only a matter of time okay it was only a matter of time all we had to do was keep standing and this this time that we're in right now is the time for the more. It's time. It's our time. All we have to do is remain calm, remain peaceful. Don't go back and forth. Keep our courts going, because that's that's the power of the court. And um, I I sent just one moment. I sent I sent some of the. Just one moment. Got a little feedback going on there. Uh, I sent some of the Moors um, uh, some video clip, you know, of of those who previously were claiming to be in control and claiming to have have us, you know, where they where they wanted us to be, uh, throwing up their hands and saying we lost them. <coughs> we lost them. You know, and we're not lost. We, we're, we're here. We're not lost. Just one moment. Uh, yeah, thank you for, uh, okay. So with that being stated. Why does the King we County website show that you're paying taxes on your house, Pauline? We're going to continue. They want to, they want to be heard so bad. So um, all we have to do is keep doing what we're doing. And everything that we put on the public record has been, has been true, is true, and will continue to be true, and will continue to manifest, okay? 
uh, we're just seeing the beginning of manifestations of who we really are and that anything that we state on the public record that we, that we agree on is truth. It's the law. So um, those, uh, the managers and uh, not the managers, I, I'm, I'm, I'm still correcting my language regularly. Uh, those custodians or subjects in the office of your Land Rover didn't come breaking, after you commanded, Pauline. What happened to their Pauline. to what they knew? Yeah, this, Pauline, where the this fuck is, is bringing the them back to 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 who they were? They remember national programs going out. They remember just having to take them to the bank and deposit them. They remember all of that. I remember national programs. And then if you go on to YouTube, you will and put in, you know, national programs from the 30s or the 20s. You'll see or the 50s or the 60s. You'll see programs popping up where products and services are being offered, products and works are being offered for the public to take advantage of. And we're going to make sure that everyone you know, can eat, that everyone can live on our land and, and, and not have it be a struggle because it's been a struggle. It does not need to be a struggle. And in the process of all of this, Moors, we are getting our businesses up and running as well so that it's, you know, so that commerce continues in the lawful manner. These same programs work at the grocery stores and everywhere else. So over the next few days, weeks, and months, we're just going to keep putting out uh, programs and things of that nature so that we um, – oh, this is uh, – just one moment. Let me make a copy of this right here. This is great. I'm so glad they keep track. Oh, I'm so glad they keep track because they keep me on track when they put these types of lists out here. Islam, right? That. that part. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm like, <laughs> I saw this the last time and I thought, oh, I should have got a copy of it. I'm so glad they put it put it back up here. So let me just, let me just, oh, by the way, Morris, uh, these stories uh, are starting to pop up in the news. Uh, like what you see on the screen about who the real Christ is, and they're starting to actually put your image and likeness there as the Christ because they know who the Christ is. This is another, and every time I see one, I'm just going to pop it up on the screen for us just to take a peek at real quick. And here's the link to the story. Uh, I saw another one, um, and again, you know, they're 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 going to tell the truth about who we are because they have to tell the truth. And and there's the link to the story right there for those who want to just read the story and see what it was about. Um, Islam, yep. Islam, Empress. Brother Sharif is trying to get in the meeting. Okay. okay. It, it's unlocked, Islam. Uh, Islam. And there will come a time when we <laughs> will be able to have a meeting and not have, you know, court gestures doing that stuff. But right now, um, they're doing the best that they can. They're doing the best they can. The court gestures are doing. They're doing the best they can. Uh, just one moment. Let me... Let me just put this here somewhere where I can refer back to it. Okay. Uh, so now uh, we we on our last call, uh, last congressional assembly, we put the um, national natural food um, program on the public record. So. What we want to do now, just one moment, 
because we're getting a little feedback here from let me let me get this feedback out of here. Islam. Okay. Um so what we did in uh let me just say a couple of things before we go into to our our topic. On January nineteenth, as we stated before, uh as of January nineteenth, and really nunk pro tunk. Um, we are moving forward with the manifestation for our economic authority. The debt system from the last era has requested their permanent leave, and we hereby grant permanent leave, eternal leave of the debt system. We grant that today. We put that on the public record. Um, Citizenship services, let me say something about that. Um, because this is something that the that Why the don't you people really question Pauline clear. about her failures? Um, that's one Why one. don't you question? <laughs> uh, okay. We're going to talk about this. We're going to talk about it. We're going to talk about what we want to talk about. We make our agenda. No one else does that. We do that. Ask Pauline so about her now, failures. Why don't you um, ever question let's her? Let's talk about. Um, question, let's talk about. Just one moment. Let me just keep putting them. I'll just keep putting them out and keep talking. When we talk about citizenship, and these are just a few points that I would like to uh, to reiterate. Citizenship, quote unquote, services began on our land in 1871, therefore said citizenship can only date back to the date that the quote-unquote country was claiming to be founded. All non-indigenous persons claiming ancestry on our land prior to 1871 had a different classification. There was no such thing as citizenship on our land before then. Not, and, and that actually wasn't even a citizenship. That was still a subject status situation. In 1954, the quote unquote Citizenship and Expatriation Act was put into, onto the, as a suggestion onto the record. Uh, and that stated that anyone unable to prove citizenship foreign citizenship is a more subject ipso jure. We place on the public record that there are more subjects ipso jure today. And we love our subjects. We're not trying to hurt or harm anyone. The protection for them is in them being in their proper status, just like protection for uh, we protect ourselves with our proper status. So um, let's see, just one moment. Let me put a couple of, um, so uh, with that being stated, any, any, anything doing business as citizenship that we have not put on the public record, it doesn't have any validity, none whatsoever. And I believe they're aware of that. Neither does any of your okay, bullshit, so Pauline. Neither does any. And so um, it doesn't have any validity. And, and, and they're aware of that. They know that already. Uh, unless we say it, it doesn't. So now, any claims of owning land and things like that are not valid because according to our Fifth Amendment, anything public cannot be made private without just compensation and due process, period. So uh, the public treasury and the public, which is the people, and the people 
is us on this land, um, there's no claim to anything unless it is put into the record and properly appropriated. And that's why these processes that we're doing are so important. When we put things on the public record, we've appropriated uh, uh, food and, and things like that. And so with proper appropriation mores, it, 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 it cannot be, no one can say, no, you can't do that. No, that, we, we actually can. And all, all mores have to do is continue to stand. Uh, it's our status that does that. Now, as a suggestion, because you can't tell Moors what to do, uh, all Moors, please place a photo of yourself. You place a photo of yourself, your sovereign-born your sovereign born appellation that your mother, who is sovereign, gave you, and your free chosen appellation and your territory on the public record so that we can do a court action in the, uh, you know, on the public record the same way we did for Justice Lamont and Justice Jiramore, because we did do a court action for Justice Jiramore as well. And the documentation is the exact same documentation uh, for, for, for both, for, for all the court actions that we've done in the last two weeks. Okay. And so um, we suggest. And this is a suggestion. You don't, you know, when we make suggestions, you don't necessarily have to do it if you choose not to, or if your spirit is saying don't do it, then your spirit, your, your spirit is first. That's your first authority is what comes from within you. Uh, as a measure of unity and as, as a measure of us continuing to stand together, uh, we suggest, it's a suggestion, that you put a photo of yourself up with your sovereign-born appellation your free chosen appellation, and your territory on the public record, okay? So that it's anyone in your territory or out of your territory can do a court action in the event that they need to do, that, 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 that needs to be placed on a public record. But what matters most is that, excuse me, is that you stand, okay? So that even if no one does a court action, you still stand and you do them for yourself. We are living witness to that. Um, and also as, a, as a, just a side note, the original constitution is the only constitution and it still contains the nobility clause as written by the sovereign heirs who have the noble title, okay? Um, when we restate the documents, we're creating a new version that is ancient, and that is where reversion of a state comes in at. The root of the words version and reversion is verse, which means words, which indicates jurisdiction. And that is why, uh, just like our Grand Sheik said this past uh, Friday at House of Reawakening Minds, uh, it is on YouTube, rewrite is the word that he used, rewrite. Uh, and that is actually what we should be doing, is rewriting everything. Because the way that things have been written on the public record uh, is not, it, it, those are corrupt versions out there, unless it's written by one of us, you know, or Islam. us together. Islam. Um, well, with that stated, um, I just need a uh, corporation um, statement that, the quote unquote, according for what they can't speak for us, even they try. But what they were doing a court action, a fictitious, you know, reporter, mm -hmm. and the one being interviewed said that um, their version of a moor is a squatter. And what I gleaned from that was it's fraud. And it's their fictitious version of, because it's not our person period. Right. So what they're saying is, in reverse, that anyone who's not a Moor is a squatter. Yes. That's really what was being stated. Anybody yes. who's not a Moor and has a nationality is a squatter. Yeah. That's what they said. So yeah. I had to put that on the public record because that is the facts. Yeah. 
Yeah, uh, they know that, and they're actually letting their quote-unquote P2 Masonic brethren know that. And we've heard the term P2 Masons, you know, in reference to the foreign subjects. Uh, does anyone ever wonder what P1 Masons are? <laughs> P1 Masons are the Moors. P stands for Pope or Papal Masons as in Knights Templar and all of that, well, by bloodline and birthright, we are P1. Uh, and we're actually, and that's our sons. Our sons are P1. So, which is, which is the highest tier of, Payson, of Mason. Uh, there's a couple of things that I... Uh, that I heard, that I've heard recently on the public record <clears throat> that I would like to reiterate also with regard to uh, the Social Security number. Um, our teachers are saying to stop saying my Social Security number, my marriage license, etc., and we affirm that. Because those, again, those are dead instruments. We must create the living instrument, okay? So, for example, my, my, my consort, I had to recreate our license, okay? We license us. No one else does that. And we license matrimony, not marriage. Uh, and for those who, who want to use the term marriage, if, if you're, you know, because you are of the bloodline and birthright, you can use whatever term you want to use, and it will mean what you intend for it to mean for you because no one else can speak for you. And so, you know, that affirms what we speak about uh, when we bring the entire state, the nation, the government, and the people with us, no matter what we're demonstrating. We always use the word we or us or our, you know, as we're restating these documents. Um, another something uh, that I wanted to uh, bring forth, and I, I hear a little bit of static coming from somewhere, so just one moment, let me see if I can do something with that static. Okay, if you want to uh, say something, you, please feel free to do so. You can star six uh, and state whatever it is, but I wanted to, to mute because I'm hearing some static coming from somewhere and I can't tell where it's coming from. Um, just one moment. Okay. Um, Always know that there are two United States, or actually there are many iterations of something called United States. We are the original states united. So when we say United States, we're talking about the living United States. When our teachers are talking about the United States, and this I appreciate so much about them, is that they're talking about the dead one and they keep, seeing, keep saying watch out for that dead one and make sure that everything that you state is rewritten and restated by you. Um, with regard to uh, the marching and the bus movements, okay, our teachers mentioned some things like that uh, this past week. When, when they were doing the bus movements and the bus boycotts and things like that, the bus boycotts are not what people think they were. They're certainly not what we thought they were. When I look at that whole bus boycott situation, I realize now that the bus boycott, first of all, it was initiated by the hybrid. Why do you think that is? It was initiated. Go ahead, nobility. 
Is um, commerce? Yes. 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 Everything they do is about commerce. What they were doing was they wanted to disconnect us from the public treasury. See, the public treasury paid for public transportation. And as long as we were a part of the public transportation, as long as we kept taking public transportation, they could not say, they couldn't disconnect us from the public treasury and start corporatizing and privatizing everything. So they had to initiate a bus boycott and look back at those ones that they used for that. And they did it under cover of, quote, unquote, civil rights. And they used those who had hybrid mothers and Moorish fathers to get that done. Such as, you know, and we're not mad at that. We're not mad at Rosa Parks. We're not mad at any of them. We ju we're just pointing out what happened and how, how what it is. Okay. Um, that's why a lot of times they will use those that look like us that are not really us. And there's no us or them because they're still under, you know, they're still, they still are part of our estate. We still have to feed everybody. We still have to take care of everybody. But we need to know how we need to, the facts need to be out there so that we know what, what to look for. Whenever they did that, that's why it made the TV, the news, it was all over the place. It was, you know, when the rest of the earth saw bus boycotts, they thought, oh, no, the Moors are giving up the treasury again. And then right after that, in, that was in the late 60s, early 70s, and then right after that came the disconnection, supposedly, of even the fiat from any remaining vestiges of a gold-backed system. But see, they, had, they, they needed to give the appearance and the acting of removing the moors from the use of the public treasury first, which is what we've re-implemented. We reactivated the public treasury. And by the way, our public treasury has uh, more in it. it we, we have enough in the public treasury for eternity, period. So that's what that bus boycott piece was all about. So whenever you see... You know, look back over over time so that you can see where if they're if they're if they were blasting it all over the television, it was probably something that we needed to be paying attention to and and giving it a, a really good look. OK, because there were several things that were done. And then that's when they changed the name of the national program to things like. Uh, food stamp programs and things like that, and it was all corporate by then. But the national programs come from the national treasury, and they're not a nation, so they don't have access to that. They're not a nation, so they don't have access to the public treasury. We do. And so that's where public... Uh, utilities and all of that that we've re we've re-implemented and reactivated on the public record. That's where all of that comes from. So um, the national programs that we're putting out, we're going to continue to do that. Uh, I wanted to go over today uh, the the lean on the grocers, and if there's any that we that that you all would like to add to that lean. Uh, and again, they've been leaned already, but we wanted to, with each program, we want to put a, the, the lean on the United States Corporation Company and, you know, the dead one, and uh, an additional lean that is more specific for the grocers. But even as I was doing the research, 
on this lien and getting the addresses and things like that, I could see in the writings and the way that they post who they are on their websites and things that they're changing it and, you know, writing out all the way the names of the state, which is the land when you write it all the way out. This is not WA, this is Washington. It's not state of Washington, it's Washington. And the same thing for your territories. And so now they're starting to spell that all the way out like it should be and um, put taking things out of all capital letters and putting it in capitis diminutio minima, which means first letter capitalized and the rest of the letters lowercase so that uh, the things that we state, they can, ac they can access through us uh, the resources but we have to state it. This Congress has to state on the public record what program is going out there. And that's why we, we're going to continue to do the research and continue to bring, uh, bring these programs forward. So we're looking through um, the program. We're looking through the programs uh, such as, yes, Indeed. Thank you, Justice Morpheus. Um, we're looking through the programs. We have to restate all the retirement programs, the Social Security, quote unquote, and we're doing it under our sovereign uh, uh, titles for nobility. Uh, so we have to restate it so that our elders who get that can access it the way that they need to access it and then state the Constitution and push forth in, in getting whatever it is that they need in order to, to, to move forward. So with that being stated, um, just one moment. Islam. Let me see who, let me see, yeah, let me see who put that out there. Okay. Uh, go ahead, nobility. Islam, Karima Bay of Virginia. <clears throat> Um, you mentioned Social Security, so I have some kin that's going to be retiring real soon. Mm -hmm. So um, the way you're mentioning it, it seems like it seems like, and correct me if I'm wrong, um, that our kin need to declare their nationality in order to get their Social Security, or is what we're doing going to allow them to be able to get their? Can you make that clear for me? Are they going to be able to get their Social Security, or do they have to? declare their nationality on the public record like, like everyone else does? They are going to have to declare their nationality on the public record okay. because the termination, of, see, everything is, is, is at will. If they will for it to be the case, then it will be the case. You know, we, what we cannot do is force anything upon anyone. You know, there is a, a billion or so that, that will do that over the next few years, at, at least at minimum a billion souls that will state who they really are on the public record. And they have time. They have time, but they do need to get, you know, when you, as soon as it's made aware to them that, oh, uh, my Social Security might be cut off, then the ancestors are going to start bringing to them that, Okay, you, you need to start looking into why that is because that old system is finished. It's, it's broke. It's bankrupted. And oh. so, they, you know, they need to. Our ancestors are not cruel. They're oh. not going to let people starve just because, oh, they didn't know. No, they're going to be made aware of, of, their, of what needs to happen just like we were. Okay, so they may get it for a period of time, and then they'll get a letter that's going to prompt them to ask some more questions and do some more research. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, Islam. indeed. Islam, thank you for that. You're welcome. It is up to them to decide. And, you know, we have stated to the ancestors and on the public record that, we, we, ev that everyone be brought in, you know, everyone be brought in to their proper status. So, and we see, we already see the ancestors setting that up and getting it ready with the programs and things because 
and, and, and also having the subjects to put things on the public record to give everybody fair warning. You know, uh, the declarations and things and the suggested declarations that the subjects have put on the public record have to be restated by us and we're going to continue to do that work. That's what this Congress is for is to put the programs out there to restate anything that we see fit to restate on the public record so that everyone is taken care of and everyone will be. Um, the only ones that, will, that, that things will get a little, little bit harder for, and, and, and I, I, don't, I, I hesitate to even state this, but I know it to be truth, are those who, who, who allow things like religion to stop them from declaring who they are. You know, uh, because some, some people have it in their minds that, that, that this is a religious situation when the law is our religion. You know, uh, Islam is about the law. So uh, we, you know, we've asked the ancestors to just continue to make it clear. And they said, you all will make it clear. We will make it clear that it's not about, that they can be, if they want to be Christians, they can be Christians. Uh, but they still have to declare their nationality. You know, bloodline and birthright Moors must do that so that they uh, are, are in the right place to, to continue to receive what is rightfully theirs. The benefits rightfully belong to, to, to the heirs. It has to be properly stated. And we use the word stated because the state is the state is the state. That is who we are. And, you know, uh, I'm just grateful that the ancestors are making it so that everything that we say and do is, man is continuing to manifest. We just have to stay steadfast, keep standing on our square, keep moving forward and doing what we're doing, and don't get tired of governing. That's the key. Don't get tired of governing, and we won't. So let's take a look at, um, yes, uh, Justice Morpheus put General Dollars, uh, Acme, Walmart, uh, he had leaned them as well. Thank you so much. Sam's Club, Target, Walmart, all of that. Yes, indeed. So uh, let's take a look at the lien that, that we're placing on the public record. And know this, this lien and all of the liens that you, you all have done go together. So this lien is not, a, a, it's not separate from the work that's already been done. It is part and parcel. Okay. So uh, let's take a look at this lien because um, the grocery, those that were doing business as grocery stores, they are actually retailers. That's actually the real name for a grocery store. It's a retailer, a retail food. Uh, outlet or retail food venue. And the reason that they are called retail food venues is in the definition of the word retail. Retail means that they chopped things up that were sold wholesale. So what the stores did was take the wholesale things that we had on the land, a whole let's say a whole bushel of collard greens or whatever, they took it and chopped it up into little pieces like a tailor would do to clothing, repackaged it, and then sold it. So that was the quote-unquote service that they were claiming to add to the works, the public works that we were doing. So they made things seem like it was uh, like they like they need like we needed them to do that when we really didn't, because we are fully capable of of parsing the things out that we need, you know, or that we desire rather. And so, you know, 
they would get a whole, let's just use a, a, a cow, for example. They would take a cow and be like, oh, the cow was sold wholesale, but let's just do a third-party interloper situation, and we'll just tell the Moors, oh, let us do it. We'll cut it up, and we'll, we'll make sure that it gets to the market. And then they start putting their labels on stuff. And then saying, oh, you have to use U.S. dollars, I mean, a, a Federal Reserve, these Federal Reserve debt notes instead of these dollars and gold coins. You can just use these Federal Reserve debt notes to get, to get what you need. So they just interloped, basically, uh, like they always did, you know. Uh, and for a while it made things uh, it seem like it was easier for us, but it really kind of wasn't. So... Um, Let's take a look uh, at, there are a total of about 36 debtors on here, on this lien. Uh, there's Walmart, debtor number one, Amazon is debtor number two, Costco, debtor number three, Kroger is debtor number four, debtor number five is Walgreens, then Target, then CVS, Sam's Club, Albertsons, Winco, Loblaw, <clears throat> Publix, 7-Eleven, Dollar General, Rite Aid, C&S Wholesale Grocers, Aldi Corporation, BJ's Wholesale Club, Trader Joe's, Hy-V Food Stores, EG America, and a lot of these are parent, quote-unquote, parent companies of ones that, you all, that we all are familiar with in our territories. Uh, Wawa Corporation, and this actually should be in all capital letters. <clears throat> Quick Trip, Associated Wholesale Grocers, Racetrack, Southeastern Grocers, A-Hole Del Hayes Corp, Sheet Corporation, United Natural Food, Hello Fresh, Big Lot, Defense Commissary Agency, and this is for those who are uh, on military bases and et cetera. Uh, that's the commissary. Um, grocery Outlet, H Mart, which is a Korean, uh, claiming to be a Korean owned corporation. Natural Grocers and Patel Brothers, which is claiming to be Indian, but not really. Uh, Islam. Islam. So Whole Foods would be with, um, what's it called, Amazon or no? Uh, if that's their parent company, and you can do the research on the parent company for Whole Foods. Yeah, right. the Whole Foods parent company is Amazon. Okay, so that, that, that got them because it's all heirs, assigned, principals, agents, and derivatives thereof. Islam. Islam. Gratitude. Yes, and you know, when we, when we say all heirs, assigns, principals, agents, and derivatives thereof, an agent would be anybody that they sell to, anybody that they do business with, anyone. So if any of the other stores have ever ordered something from Amazon or Walmart or Kroger or Walgreens or et cetera, that includes them. So we're getting all debtors, all, because in reality, we are the real original indigenous Walmart and the real original indigenous Amazon and the real original, because these companies, when you do the research on them, most of them date their origins back to the early 1900s, even though we didn't even hear about them until the, some of them the 70s and the 80s, or 90s even. We didn't hear about Amazon until later on, but when you look back and do the research, all they did was go back and look down our list of, of uh, companies that the Moors started back before 1871. See, this stuff is not new. And they said, okay, this is one that they have, so let's, you know, uh, for those who were um, part of the, who were uh, participating in the Al Moroccan American Exchange, which is still active, 
uh, we all we're doing right now is further securing. And you can look at that list of over 200 and something companies that were started by us. Every one of these is a derivative of those companies. Either they did banking with the banks or they uh, were a part of them in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Uh, so there's nothing new under the sun. Islam. Islam. They also did the same thing with our family crests. Yes, they sure did. They sure did. They sure did. Yes, indeed. Um, the family crest situation. They just claimed names and said and 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 did what capitalists do. They took the names and capitalized them and then claimed them for their own, restated them, reconstructed them, reformed them. Um, we have done a little bit of work here recently, uh, and I saw something about uh, in the chat uh, from the foreigners about the sea salt and things like that. Uh, we put a family crest on our sea salt as well. Um, in fact, I can show you just a, 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 and I'll just show you briefly what that looks like. Um, let's see. And it might not, uh, it no, might not be as two clear. Two of y'all who are getting evicted um, this weekend, this week, I know of at least two of you, the ancestors are going to evict two of you this week. Oh, it's Okay. So um, let me show you, uh, yeah. We, so this is one of our sea salt, our natural sea salt products here on the screen. And it has a family crest on it as well. And again, we're, uh, it's ancient, ancient, the ancient matriarch uh, natural sea salt. This is one of, one of our, our sea salt products. Um, and this sea salt product is backed by our government. Just like all of that other stuff, you know, like when when those that that were previously doing business as China uh, came here, they came here starting businesses, and those businesses were backed by the Chinese quote unquote government. Same thing with the United States Corporation Company. All of these, and see, they didn't they didn't tell us that it was backed by them. We thought that oh, quote unquote, Bill Gates started Microsoft. No, they got they went into the treasury for that stuff. And then the treasury was corporatized. You know, Safeway is, Safeway and Whole Foods, Safeway is a part of Albertsons. And Albertsons is on the list. I, I actually did the research on, on them because they, uh, they are here at this territory. And when I say they, I mean we, because <laughs> we're the original Safeway. Um, but we, we did the research and Albertsons is on the list as well. And so right now what we're doing uh, with ancient matriarch sea salt and sea mineral products and things is we're just, um, we put our family crest on here, the Ritchie family crest, uh, and a photo of uh, the matriarch, um, my mother, Lucille Ritchie. And right now what we're doing is just um, demonstrating and looking at, you know, how we're going to manifest continue to manifest the vast estate and, and do things using our own currency and all of that, um, you know. But they did hypothecate the family crest. So there were some hybrids who came here uh, and, you know, when they went through Ellis Island, just when, when they came here through Ellis Island, all they did was had a list and they said, okay, these moors are the Richie moors, so you can, you you can be the you all can be the Richies. You take that name and capitalize it, and you and you can be the Richies. And then just look at what the Richies owned and everything, and you just claim it and write it in all capital letters and put it on the public record. And then you can you can pretend to be the Richies. You can act like the Richies. You know, 
Most, uh, just every, every one of us, I, I, I'm convinced of this, and I know this in my knower, every one of us, Moors, had acres and acres and acres and acres and acres and acres of land. We still do. It hasn't gone anywhere. If anything, it has grown. So um, if those, those uh, companies that you all are putting in the chat, uh, if you would uh, do the research on who the parent company is and cause, because they may already be in here, especially the ones like, yeah, Food Lion, Save a Lot, IGA. Uh, I believe they're they're out there affiliated with Albertsons, but I'm not sure. Can someone look that up really quickly? Because we can add them. Um, I did see Major in there, Meyer in there. I did see Meyer. Thank you, Empress Kim Key. She's she is going to town with these uh, these retailers. If if we could if someone could and if if um if you see that they're not on this list go ahead and do a lien for them and put it on the public record please uh, because together we can get every last one of them together we can get every last one of them and many of you have already gotten these the only thing we're doing is supporting what's already been done. Okay, that's all we're doing is, is more backup, more support, more affirmation of what's already been done. Islam, and it works. Yes, it's it does. Proven yes, it proven time and time again. Yes. It does. Absolutely, it does. Uh, what we're seeing now about them saying they don't have anything further, and as of the 19th, they, you know, all of that. Uh, that has everything to do with our liens and, and all of that, you know. Uh, they're talking about a debt ceiling and all of those things. We just need to keep putting the programs out. And more as, as you demonstrate them, you get to access your own vast estate, you know. So um, the Fresh Grocer, I think Hello Fresh is on there, uh, Empress Chris. Uh, I, Empress Crystal, I believe that they're on there too. ShopRite and Rite Aid, I think, are the same. Um, yeah. Please do a lean on on all of those that you're that you're putting in the chat. Now, if you if you put them in the chat and put the address of the um, if you put the address of the headquarters, quote unquote. And the name of the one that was previously doing business as CEO, we'll, we'll add it now. If, those, if you can get those three pieces of information, we'll add it now. But if, if, you're, if you're looking at the list and someone's not there and you want to put, add them on there, then, then do a lien yourself or um, put that information in the chat and we'll put them on here right now. So with that being stated, uh, and then find out who the parent company is so that we can make sure that the parent company um, is on here or any derivative thereof. So with that being stated, are there any questions or comments or anything about, about what we're doing and about what we continue to manifest in terms of the programs, the food programs are so important for us to demonstrate right now that it's just amazing. The food, we must demonstrate the food, the food program. Islam. Islam uh, nobility. Yes. Yes. Um, pertaining to uh, ShopRite, Wayfair Foods is the parent company, and we already took care of them already. So okay. I thought, I went away from the computer, I just saw the list, I thought, so I just put that they already been taken care of already. Okay. okay. Great. Yeah. So Great. Wait for Foods, Shot White is underneath them. Perfect. Perfect. So with that being stated, with those, any that are in the chat, just make sure that there's a lien on them out there on the public record because, again, we're just putting our 
their strength and our numbers, we're putting our work together. We speak with one voice. Uh, there was another noble that was going to say something. Yes, this is uh, Keanu, Keanu L. Islam. Um, Islam, peace. Um, yeah, I'm new to, I, I just actually uh, came upon your uh, your teleconference or uh, video conference on uh, mm-hmm. YouTube. Mm-hmm. And so I, I was, uh, I'm very familiar with me being in the Chicagoland area mm-hmm. and trying to uh, submit uh, certain paperwork. I don't know if you all know uh, about, you know, the situation about, you know, these people here in uh, Cook County, you know, not allowing certain paperwork to be uh, recorded and things of that nature. And so uh, I guess I wanted to ask, you know, uh, me being new, what is your program and, you know, what exactly is uh, your your direction and, and your and your mode and also uh, <clears throat> for people who want to establish because we have chop charters up here, but nobody's really doing anything. And I'm, I'm going to say it like that. So, you know, I'm, I'm trying to be active about, you know, providing, uh, you know, a consulate for the, uh, for the people here, you know, mm-hmm. in, in, in helping people actually, and, you know, not just mm-hmm. saying things. So, I, I, mm-hmm. I, you know, that's what I wanted to ask you. Thank you for being here. Uh, Just one moment. Okay, uh, we're so glad and so honored that you're here. There is a little bit of uh, an echo coming from somewhere. I'm going to mute just one or two of the lines that are coming up. Um. Nobility, Justice Keanu, is it okay if I mute your line while I while I address what you what you asked? Yes. Because it's it's yes. okay. Okay. Um, with regard to that you brought, we don't we don't need anybody's permission to put anything on the public record. All we do is use our government mailing process and we mail it to them. And notice to agent is notice to principal, notice to principal is notice to agent. They or we or we hand deliver it and we just place it on the counter at any of the venues that were previously doing business as courts. We just go in, put it on the counter and walk back out because that's notification also, and sometimes they'll, they'll, oh, ma'am, sir, ma'am, sir, no. We just keep going. We put it on the counter and keep going because uh, notification is, is, is what it is. It's, you know, it's, we don't need permission. So we just, as long as we get it, send it, they're held accountable. As long as we send it, they're held accountable. Okay, and so do please do the study on the government mailing process. We don't use fiat to do our mailing, and um, there is a video that we have done. Can someone please get the 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 link to the mailing process that we did on at Like Tajiri Bay Channel, uh, the government mailing process? And put put the link to it in the chat, please, so that they can get that uh, that video. And it's an eight minute video. It's on like yeah, it's about eight minutes. Um, and so we don't ask for permission. We just send it. And and when we send it, it's just like if a if a, a you know in the in the last era, if a sheriff would put something on the door, they didn't care whether you got it or not. They would act. They would continue to act and continue to do things. Well, that's how we do. We just notify it. We send it out or deliver it, and they're held accountable for it. So as far as putting things on the record, when we put it on the public record, it's actually the law. We don't, we don't even wait for them to put it on the public record because they're not really the law. We are, and they're held accountable. 
So, um, and then you said something about, you know, charters and things at uh, Illinois Territory. I will say this about charters and things. We honor, first let me say this, we honor all of those Moors and the temples, the Moors science temples and the Moors holy temples for science. Uh, we we honor honor the work that they are doing uh, when done you know as they're doing it in the spirit of love, truth, peace, freedom, and justice. Um, if there are any charters for any temples that let's say they registered under the United States Corporation Company and those charters are lying dormant, uh, if you see the charter. And I'm not saying you have to go there. This is not a confrontational issue because we're not at war with each other. But if the charter is on the public record, all you have to do is restate the charter. All you have to do is just rewrite it from start to finish, put it on Morse government letterhead, and it's a valid charter. Uh, restatement, reconstruction, reformation, all of that is in full effect for our nation, our government. Because nothing is the law unless the Moors say it's the law. And we, we state things by reconstructing it and putting it on Moorish government letterhead. We type it over word for word or, you know, however you do that, however you restate it, it does need to be restated. And then you look at the language in it because even some of the things from that supposedly from 1929 and you know, they'll say, oh, the Prophet Noble Ali said this and that. We actually have to look good at that, the things that, they, that, that, that is, has been said. They said he said that, but we have to look good at it and then edit according to what we know to be the law because there's been some hypothecation and subrogation even of the words of the Prophet. And then we look back at the Constitution and the treaty and we had to restate those also because the, the ones that we've been seeing in the supposed Library of Congress are war documents and debt documents. So we had to re, rewrite, restate, reform, reconstruct. And so when you look back in history and, and see uh, periods that they call the Reconstruction period and the Reformation and the Renaissance, all they were doing was rewriting things that, were, that the Moors had originally already put on the record. And all we're doing is taking it back, period. So when you look at things and it says, oh, this was adopted, this constitution was adopted in 1776, all that means is they looked at what the Moors did and they rewrote it and, and, in, many, and in every case it's corrupted. So we have to just restate it. So again, if you see any charters that are, that are not being you know, utilized, look at the language in them because they might be not using them because they know they're not, they're not effective if they're corrupted, if they're corrupted. And what, what are we saying? We're saying that not all temples are corrupt. Um, we know that, the, that there are some that, that, that had some things going on in the, in the language that was corrupt. So, um, we're not mad at anyone. We love our temple brothers and sisters. They are part and parcel for this government by bloodline and birthright, and so we honor them. We're just stating that we're going to state and restate and state and restate everything. We're looking at everything. It doesn't matter who, who they say said it or who they say wrote it, and when I say they, I mean anyone. We're going to look at it carefully and restate it properly because we're looking at the Constitution and it's like that's a, that's actually a debt document. We have to we we had to restate that properly. So, uh, brother, we are so glad that you're here. And you know, I know that was a little bit of a long answer, but anything that you don't understand that we that we state. Just we all we ask is that you just keep listening, keep speaking, keep demonstrating. It will come. 
So do yes, you sir. all have a, uh, what do you call a, like, a website for me to, you know, grow in my studies? and? You know, there are there? many. There are okay. many. Yeah. Okay. So when you go out there, just Google Morris Science. There are so many Moors who have done websites and put our documents up there and other documents up there that we say just go do the, the research and you will, but your spirit will know. You will know truth when you hear it. Your spirit will affirm it. Right. So yeah. this, these programs that you're speaking of, I'm, I'm new, so mm -hmm. I'm not necessarily knowing what you all are doing, you know, what direction you all are moving. Yeah. So the United States Corporation Company, the dead one that was run by foreigners, is no more. And all of the supposed programs that they had out there, such as Social Security, food stamps, anything, uh, Section 8 housing, anything, that, anything of the, that nature where, where people could be sustained, those programs are broke, bankrupt. And so we, we, we don't, we're, because we know this is chess and not checkers, when we move something out of the way, we have to put something worthy in its place. Okay, and then we just demonstrate what we put in its place, like the sister was saying, you know, about these programs. So from this point, we're just introducing programs. We introduced a program where, you know, Moors could go and, and the Moors who need something to eat can go and get something to eat. Well, we have since uh, added to that uh, coupon that the Empress was talking about, and we've made it so that it includes any restaurants, any retailers, any stores, and we will we'll introduce that. Uh, let's see. In fact, I would like to show that to you right now. I was going to wait another week uh, to show it because I wanted to go back through it, but even as I was writing it and the ancestors were putting it forth um, in my spirit, Um, we can just go over it now, and empresses, I will need, you know, we, I would love for your, your input and emperors, and I'm speaking to all empresses and all emperors. Please, your, your input is valuable and very necessary and important when it Islam. comes to this program. Yes. And so with that stated, um, for the good brother who was asking about, you know, places to go and things, just be sure that if they ask for any type of fiat, they are not um, to be charging anybody for anything that we give freely. So be cautious of that if they ask for fiat because our information is to the public, for everybody, everywhere yeah. at Earth. There is nowhere that this paperwork is not available for the people and it's already been pre prepaid. So yeah. if they ask you for any type of, you know, fiat yeah. of any kind, you know, stay clear and be mindful of that. Yeah. Uh, uh, we just, we just, all we have to do is stand. Thank you for that, Empress. That's, that's, that, is value, that is valuable to state that uh, we have gotten away from the fiat system because the fiat system really is no more. And so we have our own money, we have our own banks, we have our own everything. All we have to do is demonstrate that. So um, these programs are programs that anyone can use. It doesn't matter who you are, you can use it. Even, even the, the subjects that are here on our land, they can use these coupons and things too to get whatever food or whatever is being offered. They can get, they can get it too because they need to eat. We do not want anyone on our land to be sleeping under a bridge and not having anything to eat and any of that. I don't care what they look like. I don't care where they come from. We don't want that. Our land is supposed to be a place where people can come and do whatever, knowing that it is because of the sovereign here on this land that through us, all of the nations that are, are to be blessed, 
that's in the writings. That's in the writings of the ancient sibyls as well as uh, the bibliotelio text. Uh, let's see. Empress Karima has placed some uh, websites in the chat that you can go and look at. Uh, we don't have any one because there are so many um, websites out there. And I prefer it that way, that more is just go and do your research, go and do your study, put something in and see what comes up. Because unlike when I first, because I, 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 have, I have known who I am only five years since 2017. And um, when I first nationalized, there wasn't very much out there in terms of uh, websites and things like that. Uh, but the websites that were out there, we, we were so grateful to see them. We were so grateful to see them. RV Bay Publications, we were so grateful that there, that website was out there. Uh, Clock of Destiny, we were grateful that they were there. And um, Moorish Directory, we were grateful. And I think there might have been one or two more at that time, about four or five websites. Today, because so many Moors are waking up, there and starting their own websites and putting information up to assist their kin and to and and to be able to point people to to information uh we just like that you can go and just google and and whatever comes up because we know that your energy will determine what comes up for you so uh with that being stated um we also know that at some point everything that we've put on the public record will be on a .gov website. And we're preparing for that. So um, this is the latest program, the, the National Tr uh, Trust Program that we're putting out. Uh, beginning on Thursday, January 19th, 2023, and that's Greco-Roman civil calendar and not any corporate calendar. Islam is not showing. Uh, okay, just one moment. Thank you, Empress. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, let me get to it. Just one moment. I'm actually having to collapse the other one. Just one moment. <laughs> ah, it is on the screen, but ah, uh, it's let me let me just let me go here to my sharing. Is it on the screen now? It should be. Yes, it's on. Okay. Yes, it is. Thank you so much. Uh, this. Uh, this platform is something special, I will tell you that. So uh, this is the seal for the Supreme Court. This is the banner for Amity and Commerce, and this is the, the seal for the Treasury, the National Treasury. It says United States Treasury National Trust Programs to all food chain restaurants, food stores, and custodians. Beginning on Thursday, January 19, 2023, the long-standing trust for the United States is hereby made available and conveyed to the public via the United States Treasury National Trust Programs. These trust programs strengthen the agricultural economy, 
achieve a fuller and more effective use for food abundances, and provide for improved nutrition among all peoples from the United States Treasury National Trust programs operated through normal channels of trade and for other purposes, thereby stabilizing and uplifting the United States economy, the livelihoods for all Americans, and for global financial trust stability. Uh, and here this say, and I'll be, I want to choose the words wisely. And this is so that you all can see how, how we come about these things. Uh, generally, we just look at the wording, the language that's being put, suggested, and then we choose how we, you know, how we want to express whatever it is that's being stated. Islam, I mean, yes. Yes. briefly. Mm -hmm. um, from what we stated on our previous congressional meeting on Thursday, mm -hmm. the National Food Stamp Program law and the um, amounts of the $75 million, the $1 million and the, correct me if I'm incorrect, but it seems like the National Food Stamp Program, uh, we stated that our national currency would be the one that would be, you know, in the exchange for, yeah. um, is going to essentially underwrite this that we're doing now. Yes. Yes. That, that just came to me as you're just reading this. And I had to pull out my document that I had did print, and I'm like, Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We underwrite everything yes. that we do by yes. our own virtue of doing it. Yes. One precept precedes the next, and it's a add unto, as I like to state. We add unto anything that we do is adding unto what we've already done. Yeah. Yes. Yes. You know, it's it's interesting. You should use the word unto because when the foreigners used that word, it actually meant not to. So when you say unto, if if we were in our sleep, that's a word that that they used to undo things. Whereas with us, it's it means exactly what we intend for it to mean. So um, further reading here, it says United States Treasury National Trust programs are not taxed. Therefore, the public is not taxed for their participation in United States Treasury National Trust programs. The full faith and trust for the United States is protected and remains Tier 1 AAA, and those who are familiar with ratings system in the financial markets um, will know what a AAA rating means in terms of uh, the, the stock market and the Dow Jones and, and so on and so forth and credit ratings. Uh, we've always had AAA ratings as the living creditor United States versus the dead debtor United States, which is foreign to us. Uh, it says the full faith and trust for the United States is protected and remains tier one triple A with increased participation in United States Treasury National Trust programs. So the more we participate, the better. The Federal Deposit Insurance Company guarantees trusted payment for all United States Treasury trust and redemption programs and uh, redemption is the right word that we intend for it to mean. In alignment with Public Law 117.73 and 31 United States Code subsection 3101, the current redemption value of a trust obligation issued on a not taxed basis and redeemable at maturity at the option of the titled creditor is the accepted face value amount for the trust credit. Coupons issued pursuant to this law are trust obligations for the United States within the meaning of Title 80, 18, United States Code Section 8, and the intention of the people. Islam, have we leaned any seed companies? 
Uh, Morris, have we leaned any seed companies? Have any more leaned any seed companies? Islam. Uh, I have not, but that's on my to-do list. Islam. Islam. Okay. Now, and I will say this about that. Uh, thank you, nobility. And Empress, uh, who asked that question, that very valid question, all law is specific. So at your will, lean as many seed companies as you, as you choose to do. We've done an overarching lean. So... So they're already leaned by the nation, but we want to specify by name that resource so that we can uh, use that resource at will as well. Thank you for that question as well. Uh, this United States Treasury National Trust Programs coupon is valid for one free meal per day per coupon holder at all food venues. Uh, Non-alcoholic drinks are included. Imported meat is not included. A 33% gratis for weight staff is included in the total final redemption value. Receipt must be signed by creditor, customer, and a company trust redemption receipt, and it expires March 21st, 2023. Um, the reason that we put an expiration date on here, and just let me know what you think about this, Morris, uh, because any of this part right here can be, we can pull it off and not, not have it be there. Um, you don't necessarily have to, to sign anything if you choose not to. Uh, we just know that we know who the creditor is. Excuse me. The creditor is the Morris. And because it's coming through the Treasury, uh, we can actually remove this, this part about signing. What do you think? Should we leave this on here or remove it? Uh, remove it. Leave it off. I'll leave it on. Okay, how many... Uh, Islam, can I say something? Can we put the language that they can um, autograph on their discretion? What do you think, Congress? All law is specific, so I would suggest that we make it one or the other. And uh, with that being said, I think that we should um, add our autographs, and they should be um, in Capitus Diminutio Nolo and in red ink to demonstrate um, how we demonstrate Islam. Islam, I affirm. I affirm. I affirm. <laughs> we all love that one. I, I affirm. I affirm. I affirm. I affirm. I affirm. I affirm as well. I kind of like that one. Morris, don't forget your red pins. <laughs> but, right. but, no, no, I like yeah. to add, I, with all the coupons that I've ever seen, the expiration date is a lot longer than what you have here. Okay. So I'm requesting that that be extended at least okay. you know, 90 days or something. What do you think, Morris? We don't we don't ha have to put an expiration on it. We're going to tailor the programs as we go. We're going to put the I law think, on the public uh, record. I think we don't need the expiration date. Islam. 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 Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> <laughs> Infrashasha. <laughs> oh, okay, wonderful. Um, my question is. Why did you put them on there in the first place? That, that's a great question. So I was looking at the suggestions that the, that the subjects put out there in terms of their January 19th suggested proclamation by, by the subject Janet Yellen. Right. And um, what she mentioned in that suggested document is, extraordinary measures and them not knowing how long the extraordinary measures will last uh, until things, you know, return, get to some semblance of order. Mm -hmm. Because again, this is, this will be new, but not new for, for, for many out there. Many have not seen this, these types of programs in many years, if at all. Yeah. So uh, I put it there so that we could revisit, the date is there so that we could revisit at that time 
to see how the program is going, but we can do that anyway without a date, whether it's there or not. But I was just thinking in terms of uh, that's our new year mm -hmm. and that we would revisit the program and make any changes to it and updates to it that we saw fit to do, this Congress, uh, as we put the program out there. But I do know that, that um, we wanted to get the maximum participation as soon as possible. Okay. So that's why I put that date there. Well, I think, you... And I think as you explain it, and also, as you said, it's the um, our new year, I mm -hmm. think it's a, a good idea to have a date on there, simply mm -hmm. because that also helps to kind of keep us on track. Not that we're not on track, but, you know. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, why don't we make it uh, unlimited? Hold on, just a moment. Hold, hold on for just a moment, uh, Empress Aisha. Let, let Empress Aisha finish, cause, and then we'll, we'll hear you in, indeed, Empress. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Go ahead, Empress Aisha. Um, so that, that piece, um, that makes sense. And, and I, I mean, I like the idea that it's the new year. It doesn't mean that it necessarily has to be that date, but maybe mm -hmm. even revisiting on that date is part, mm -hmm. could be part of our schedule. But my question um, regarding the signature yeah. and, and even the language, and I, I really do, I affirmed, as I said, with mm -hmm. autographing it in our red pen and, Mm -hmm. But then we have creditor slash customer, and mm -hmm. they are two separate. They're two. I mean, that's two separate statuses, is it not? Creditor and a customer is different from a creditor. A creditor is different from a customer, and because anyone can use them, so that's why I did it that way. You, and I get that. I absolutely get that. Um, and so, but it doesn't have to say that way. It could. We will know who the creditor is by the red pen. If they pull out a, a pen any a color other than red, then they're a customer, and that's okay, that, too. That is true, unless they like their fancy colors and decide to, you know. But yeah. I, I, just, I just wanted to um, uh, make that distinction. And, and of course, yes, yeah. of course, the pen will make a difference. Yeah. I just wanted that clarification in my own mind because mm -hmm. um, I do know that they are two different things. Yes. So, wonderful. Yes. Thank you. We just uh, want to make sure, thank you, Empress Shasha, for those very valid questions because we want to make sure that we cover all, you know, that all can, everyone can enjoy our land that way. Uh, but we also want to make sure that we keep the statuses in front. Exactly. So that no one forgets Exactly. You know. I, I absolutely that's um yeah. well, you've made it very clear, thank you. And um I maybe we can tweak that just a little bit. Uh, yes. And yes, however you however this Congress chooses. Empress, do you have uh now just because we put it at March twenty first as the expiration does not mean that the program will expire, it just means that this this document uh, will expire. And I think your explanation covers um, well enough for me anyway. Um, um, so that can stay. Mm -hmm. um, I, what, if, what if we said receipt must be signed by a creditor um, and or customer or something like that? Just to make that distinction. Mm -hmm. Maybe the language is wrong, but, um, you know, my suggestion there, but I don't know. And then uh, as I said, the pen is going to make that determination anyway. So Yes. And you know what else is going to make that determination, Empress? And our prophet said it, but we're going to manifest this. Turbans and fans is when you go out. We, 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 yes, absolutely. We uh, need to start looking like this is home. Absolutely. Absolutely. And that's just my, you know, it's a suggestion. You can't tell sovereigns what to do. But when I go out with my red pen, this, I'm having, I have turban on and I'm enforcing, etc. you know. Yeah. No, you I, know. that one sings to me. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Islam. Our prophet Islam. said that, 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 that turbans and fezes were going to be all and everywhere. Can you scroll down so I can read the um the entire document again, please? 
Oh, oh uh, the other way. The the where we have the language. Yes, yes. thank you. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and we're, we're I want to uh, want to take a look at the bottom part of it as well, because the the bottom part is for the is for the merchants uh, and not merchants but the custodians in the office of merchant because we're the merchants. When when we talk about things like red lobster and all of that, we're red lobster, <laughs> not anyone else. Those are wait staff and custodians. Or not, and, and and I hesitate to say custodians. I say subjects, because we're we're in custody of everything. Everything is in our custody now. We just have to use it. You know. Islam. Islam. Did we not also do a coupon for Trader Joe's? Islam. It would be covered with this. All food chain restaurants, food stores, and custodians, and we could we could actually add retail stores, retail foods. Uh, we could say, uh, and grocers is going to mean what we mean, what we what we mean for it to mean. Um, what, I was, what I was going to suggest is yes. that we since March is so close that. Maybe that date we just revisit it annually. Okay, uh, I have we've heard that several times. So all in favor of we could we could even move that to December twenty first, which is the, the winter solstice. We could move it to December twenty first if if you're in favor of that. If 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 this Congress Ooh. is in favor of that, I'm in favor. I'm in favor. <laughs> <laughs> All in favor. Yes, Islam. Islam, ISM. So I do have one question now. Well, can we can we first before you go to the question, can we first just affirm or not affirm the changing of the date to December twenty first? Affirm. 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 Now that does not preclude us revisiting prior yes. to that if yes we okay. have that option to to revisit at will absolutely okay Islam. 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 are there any who uh do who um who suggest that we not change the date are there any nays to the date is there any Yes, Empress. Yes, Karima. I see you clarify. Okay, um, hold on, please, one at a time. Empress Karima, please, first. Yes. Um, so, of course, I'll go with what whatever the Moors want collectively. Um, mm -hmm. because, but because it was um, asked if there's any name. Initially, I would say name because based on how you clarify it, March 21st is the new year, and I thought that was a great idea from the jump. So I would say nay and keep it at March 21st, 2023. Islam. Mm -hmm. Islam. Islam, thank you for that, Empress Karima. We need to hear. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Justice Sharif, I believe, was going to say something. Yes, uh, Empress. Uh -huh. um, you want us to use those vouchers, Empress. I suggest that you don't put an expiration date on it because you never know what people's situation may be. Mm -hmm. Why put an expiration date on it? Well, here's the thing about not knowing what people's situation. We actually do know what people's situation is. People need food. I'm, and I'm they need... Of getting there before the expiration date. That's what I'm speaking of. Um... If if they really need it, they'll get there. But again, even after this time period, even after March 21st, we're going to extend it because it's going to keep going. Okay, we're just I I really put it there for for us to ensure that we revisit regularly. This Congress must continue to look at what we put on the public record, govern it uh, according to what it what is going on out there. Uh, on our land, and then make the adjustments as necessary. 
So we actually have a, a majority vote to extend it to December 21st. How many nays do we have? How many choose to keep it at March 21st? We, right now, it, based on what's been stated and the chat, we have a majority that say move it to December 21st. Well, Islam, uh, um, upon new information mm -hmm. um, and the logic of reasoning, and that our new year is that March 21st, 2023, and for bookkeeping reasons and accounting reasons, I would vote for March 21st, and then the 22nd, we can start a new chapter and in our um, accounting and go from there. So let me say this about accounting. accounting. Accounting is going to continue regardless. It ha It's going to continue regardless. Well, we, we will not, be able I'm aware, but just for because it's the new year for us, and we want to, from yeah. my understanding, to shift the truth of the new year because the fiscal year, you know, they end their you know, their bookkeepings, you know, in, in the in the visual, but behind the closed doors, that happened in October. Any so, um but um and I know this, but um before, you know, stating the new year and celebrating the new year and, you know, what comes with generally the new year, yeah. I'd like to change my vote to keeping it as March twenty first. Okay. You said that three times now. Islam. Islam I, nobility. I as well. Okay. How many say uh, keep it at the 21st of March? Now, full disclosure, on March 21st or March 22nd or somewhere around there within that time period, we are going to have to revisit this so that we can extend it if, we, if it needs to be extended or whatever the case may be. We're going to need to do that. So those who are saying that March 21st, um, leave it at March 21st, please be prepared to meet during that time period. We're going Islam. to be meeting anyway, you know. Yeah, because the 19th is a Sunday and that's two days before the 21st, so we can vote, you know two days before to have it, you know, just continue on. Okay, so I see a few changes of the vote in the in the um, chat. I'm okay with either way because the program will, will continue because we know people need it. Uh, but we can, you know, if you choose, we can put March 20, you know, leave it at March 21st. Uh, so let's Islam. just take a Islam Empress. I agree in it, uh, with Angel. Mm -hmm. Also, that uh, gives us um, all um, experience with governing our territories. Yes, Islam. 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 As well, I'm going to add to what Empress just said. As well, it uh, allows us to see the response yeah. of the people in this coupon. Islam. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's that was all. All that you're saying was my thinking around putting March 21st. Is 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 let's let's get it out there and 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 look at the results and then go from there. Make any changes or updates accordingly. I'm going to go back to my original two. Let's leave it there. As I had said, didn't preclude us if we change the date because yeah. I think we should we should be looking at it at that time anyway, whatever we put on there. So yeah. let's leave it there. Islam, I'm with the majority. Islam. Thank you, Empress Aisha. You, you we we honor majority. your wisdom. Yeah. Islam, thank you, Empress Cynthia. The majority has changed <laughs> to March 21st, and that's, that's, I'm looking at what's being put in the chat as well. 
is uh, how many state that they want it to be December 21st again, please? Aisha. Islam Empress. Okay. I just want to affirm the majority being March 21st. Uh, Empress Gloria says December 21st. Islam, I affirm. Affirm the 21st? Correct. Okay. And state your appellation? I would have victors, right for Lord L. Islam. Kim Q. Rice. Islam. Islam. December 21st. Islam. Just as I seem, I can hear you back there. It, it just sounds like you're really far away, by the way. Okay. Is that better? That's much better. Great. Yes, I, I also affirm for March 21st. March 21st. Okay. Uh, I think the majority, Justice on Longo, is saying March 21st. Uh, uh, there's majority March 21st in the chat, Justice Akil. Uh, Justice Asa Dula. Uh, let's see, Justice. Uh, uh, let's see. Justice Dumois, Justice Sawu, Justice Morpheus. Uh, Kim Ki said uh, yes, but I think that was a nay for the. I'm not sure. You may have to clarify. Um. December. I, December. Okay. Yes, I, I, I. Yes, I got. So so far for December, it is. Uh, it's still a majority for March 21st, based on what I'm seeing here and the votes that have been cast thus far. It's still a majority for March 21st. Um, and again, the program won't end. Then we'll just, you know. We'll revisit and see how it's going uh, at the territories and get the reports in from the people and um, and go from there. You know, um, let me just look again. Islam. Islam, uh, Justice Hazim. I would like to suggest that we do something very similar along the lines of hotels and motels. That type, that type of thing as well. Very that is going to be a separate, yeah, it'll be separate, but, but we that, do have that yeah. program that we're going to be implementing. Justice Azim, is there a, uh, we've been working on the Section 8 piece. We can look at the language there in Section 8, but there's also uh, King County, Washington here. They have a... Um, request for proposal process and again we're not talking about them we're talking about us we're King County and we need to look at that because that will that will that will do it will bring forth and manifest the hotel piece great um, but we do need to take a look at it and restate it and 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 things we brought it out about probably six months ago or so, uh, but we need to take a look at that again. And then at your territories, go on to either the county or the state website, quote unquote, and see if they have any, uh, they generally come under homeless or, or unhoused program so that right. we can restate them. Okay. Uh, Section 8 is, is probably the best place to look because uh, that is going to be where the majority of the heirs who need a uh, house or domiciles rather, um, when it's properly stated, there will be a much better choice of what, what what we put in our programs. And again, our programs are going to elevate everything that has to do with food, housing, everything is going to be elevated through these programs, including the hotel piece. So 
Okay. Let's take a look at the programs and then look at what we're going to rewrite. Section 8 is one that we started rewriting and then also the hotel piece. We definitely need to get, get to that hotel piece as soon as possible, you know. So yes, we will, okay. we will elevate that to a priority. Yes, because people are out in the streets being locked up for living in the streets here in Missouri. They're on the streets. They're in jail. Yeah. So and they be doing that. <laughs> yes, they're going to do that. Why? Um, Empress Kim Key. Yes. You know, uh, it's just it, it's 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 actually less expensive to put them in a high end hotel. Right. They won't do that. They'll lock them but, up and leave them in there. But you know, you know what? Excuse me. Uh, Empress Kim Key, continue, please. Yes. Um, <clears throat> I got locked up the other day, and he, they they were bringing them in by the bunches mm -hmm. because they were out there sleeping on the streets, and they have nowhere else to go. Mm -hmm. And it, it it's just ridiculous. Yeah. Okay. Excuse me. This is Empress Aisha L. Yes, Empress. I, th I think we need to look at uh, start looking at a long range um, mental facilities because you know they they threw that out period, and we have many many people that need that service. I yes. think we need to get started back up. Yes, we have a lot of needs. Or and when I say need the the I mean we got a lot of stuff to fix on our land right. Right. to address as as the Congress. So we're going to get to it as quickly as we can, but we want to be thorough, and right. we don't we don't want to feel like we have to rush and throw a bunch of stuff out there without giving it any thought. We want to give it thought. Yes, uh, Justice Morphy's doula is also the health care piece. All of that has to be addressed. The good thing about that is that. We have time to do it, so let's take the time to do it. Right. Our ancestors wanted us in this very mindset that we're at right now of mm -hmm. looking at the problems and the issues that are on the land and then knowing that we are the remedy. Yes. Okay. We're there. Islam. Islam, Justice Aizen. Uh Just to add what the young lady mentioned about they're locking up a lot of the moors on this on this streets, things like that. Mm -hmm. Basically, in general, what they're doing is giving them an option to go into these housing facilities, but they refuse. They want to continue to uh, remain where they are because going into those housing situations, they have curfews, they have uh, expiration uh, time as to how late they can stay in the room or hotel. And curfews as to when to be back in the hotel. So mm -hmm. the majority of the people do not like that. So that's why they're taking them in as far as locking them up, per se. Because if they refuse uh, the, those uh, recommendations, then they're taken to jail. So that's what's happening in general, is law. So with regard to that, here's where we have to carefully look at what's being going what's going on there are some who from a mental perspective need to be in a place where they can um, clear their thoughts they need to be in a place they may need to be in a mental place a place where they can clear their thoughts and get things together so that they can properly function. There are others who who are some some can be a little bit rebellious and just don't want to, you know, and, and, and I get that. And then others have just had a, a bad, they've had bad experiences per se. And all they really need is someone is is, is a is um, an opportunity to choose and not be constrained by lack of fiat or lack of not, and I can't say lack of fiat, lack of resources, because fiat is not a resource. And that's why a lot of them are out there in the first place is because fiat didn't even help them. So 
we have to take a look at all of that. And, um, you know, I will say this about that. There are many who just, they know that they deserve better than what they, the treatment they've been getting. They just have to know who they are and know how to obtain the things that they need. So, you know, there are those different scenarios out there. We as the Congress are going to address the mental health aspects of it and we're going to put something on the public record so that the Treasury can assist there. All of these issues is, is why we needed to stand. We needed to stand. And so with that being stated, um, let's if, just... Um, uh, yes, Empress. Can you put the document back on the screen, please? Because um, I just want to um, ask a question regarding this. So okay. I, I read in... Uh, just, just one moment. Just, just one moment. Uh, let, me, let me finish what I'm, I'm stating about, about where we're going and what we're doing in terms of all of this. We're going to address each and every issue. Let's, let's not put ourselves under the pressure of feeling like we have to address everything all in one day because we'll be revisiting and putting things on the public record as, you know, as they manifest. So with that being stated, Empress, I yield the floor. Islam, the table. <laughs> the table, thank you. No problem. <laughs> and so um, it states that this is a coupon for uh, one free meal per day um, per coupon holder at the food run vendors, right? Genius. So, in our previous work... Pauline, are we, you still talking your bullshit? We, we talked ahead, about your land. Go ahead, nobility. We've um, done work and had, you know, extensive conversations concerning, um, you know, demonstrations at grocery stores for, um, you know, just like you know, everyday household needs, you know, bulk items, you know, whatever, soap, toiletries, you know, shampoos and things of that nature. So because this lien is for all, you know, grocery stores and such and this coupon, so what I'm getting at, can, is this, this, this is in conjunction with our previous demonstration, essentially, correct? All of our demonstrations are connected. All of well, them. Well, and for the, let me say this about. I'm sorry. Go ahead. And let me say this about them. Uh, we, as a people, have to continue to connect the things that we've done in the past with what we're doing now, so that we know that we, in, within ourselves, that we have the authority to do the things that we're doing. Um, they're getting used to us being here now. So, yeah, to answer the question, yes, everything that we've done in the past. And I will say, Morris, please, as we demonstrate these things, please, I, I won't beg because sovereigns don't beg, but our nobility, please let it be front and center in everything that we do. And, and where groceries and grocery stores and retailers and things are concerned, use your better judgment in terms of quantities and things like that. Yes, get what you need. Yes, get what you need. Uh, know that others want to come in and get what they need also because we are in transition. This is a transi transitory place. Okay, we're in transition and the ancestors are saying, okay, how will they do as we as we as we go through this transition, how what are the more how how are they gonna do? You know, get get for you and and your your heirs, and then you know don't do anything way out there, and you'll know because your Angel spirit will say. Tell us about that free car you got. So, Angel um, Man. And so, okay, go um, ahead. Yes, and also because we also talked about receipts with that demonstration pertaining yes. to the um, groceries and such. So, yes. in and adding unto, so this is how I'm seeing this in 
my perspective, um, is, you know, we do the itemized receipt with the um, amount that they say that the value of the items are for at the end. And then we would, you know, put on notice that we are coming because we're always supposed to state that we are making our arrival. Mm -hmm. And then um, put on the public record um, the transaction and then do our own bookkeeping as far as accounts receivable and, you know, thus credited to the um, proper locations and because we don't debt nothing. So it's just credited to credited mm -hmm. and so on and so forth. And so, um, and then um, to add unto would this document would could also be um, amended and edited to um, state that you know items you know shopped for or however the language would be um, and the voucher would would for the um, national trust program um, for items shopped or you know received or however the language is and so on and so forth if I'm making sense. No, that didn't make sense. Uh, about the, the last, just the last couple, the last sentence, I, I overstood everything you said before that, but that last couple of sentences about the receipt. And well, I don't stop for. Well, because you put that language in this document as well to make everything cohesive and add that with your receipts. So it's like they have their own coupon because mm -hmm. everything essentially is a coupon anyway. Yeah. It's prepaid. Yeah. Gotcha. So with regard to the accounting piece on this, the sub the the system is going to account for each each coupon received. So we don't necessarily have to do the receipt piece and all of that with this because the receipt is going to be there. Oh, uh, but this is for um, food meals. I was talking about like actually grocery shopping. Uh, the food stamp piece will cover that. Okay. And this is again in connection with that. Mm -hmm. This is in connection with it. We just had to have, see, in order to appropriate this, we had to go to the, to, in order to appropriate from the Treasury, we have to point to something in the Constitution first and then link it. So we, the food, this, this fall, this kind of goes under the food stamp program. It's a part of it. Mm -hmm. That's what this, this uh, is that's on the screen, this coupon piece. It's just that there are many out there who don't have Delarium in their, you know, in their inventory yet. Um, and so this will assist those who don't have Delarium in there or who may not even know who they are, you know. Uh, just like in Empress Kimki, she, you know, she's just hearing about these things, and you know, her and her her friends in in the territories are are saying, "Look, what's happening over here?" That's 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 how we really wanted this to work. That's the that's the goal. Is wake up, everyone. You're Moors. You're the heirs. That's really to me the the purpose of all of this. But you know. We also want to make sure everybody eats. So this is part of that program. This is part of the food stamp program. Because it's, it's, it's all, all of that is coming under the national trust. And so each program that we implement from this point to include the hotels, the Section 8, the housing, and all of that is, is going to be the same thing, general welfare clause of the Constitution. Yeah. Islam. So with that stated, um, just going back to the um, National Food Stamp Program mm -hmm. um, and the language that we did um, vote on, um, though the language, I did reread it and, um, mm -hmm. because it stated that, you know, visits and checks and, you know, um, essentially approval and, you know, their 
they 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 have the intake in like um the initial um what is it what is it when they come and you do the initial meeting and then they ask you their questions and thus and so and mm, no, we don't we don't do that they because they they don't they they don't they don't get to sit down and do and interrogate but the um I'm trying to find it. I wish I marked it. No, no one, no one, no one is going to sit down and just be interrogating the Moors about that which they already know, because they already know that they're broke. Janet Yellen told them they don't have, they're done. And so, you know, and again, she's just, she's a subject. So okay. we're going to just implement and, and, and it doesn't, Whatever issues that come up, if there be any, there may not be any, because I I know that people that that national programs is not that old. It's not it's not like n they never heard of them. They have heard of them, you know. And we'll just demonstrate them, Moors. We'll just demonstrate them. Islam. Yeah. Yes. Um. Though on section E of administration, mm -hmm. um. It says the state agency of each state desire to participate in the food stamp program shall submit for approval. So um, that's everybody's that's, approved already. Okay. So we, did, we we basically just all we're do, all we're saying right now is let the people eat. The people okay. can get what it, what they what they need because we've implemented that already. You know, let the people do what get what they need post haste. Okay. So we're not going to right now we're not it's not a matter of a bunch of documents flying back and forth cuz we actually already did that. When we put the const the state constitutions on the public record, that was your putting forth of okay, and that's that's for now. But as we continue and that's why we're going to be revisiting and continuing to govern and all of that, that when it's time for us to to state again, because right now we're speaking with one voice. All of the states, the sovereign states that we all are, are speaking with one voice saying this program we opt in with a majority vote. And we, we did a majority vote on both, on all the issues. That's why the voting on the public record is so important. Because once understand. we put it on the public record, everyone ha has to, you know, it's the law. Well, I just wanted some um, further clarity on just making sure that. Um, I so appreciate that about you. Thank you. <laughs> we have to do that. We have to do that. That's what this is for. Okay. This, was the clarity provided, Empress, or 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 what? Is there any other clarity? Well, yeah, um, that's that's clarification and because you know like stated this is a national document and you know that's why it's important that you put your national documents in like you suggested putting your your photo of your state and who you are and and so on and so forth on the public record so um people know you know because we state so and then um you know the furthering um affidavits well, along with the national document is um you know essentially will make it all work as well as your knowing and making it work yeah yeah uh so whenever i put like the things that i've put on the public record all the moors at washington can put the exact same thing on the public record because we're all one like i Yes, I'm the governor, but so are they. <laughs> you know. Yes, ma'am. We're all the president. We're all of us are the president for the United States. All of yes, us. Sir. Islam nobility. Um, I just got four more text messages of uh, other Moors that I sent the coupon to. Mm -hmm. and Sixteen people literally ate. <laughs> that real life. I just want to put that on the record. Islam. Islam. Thank you for that. Uh, Islam, we, can you say the territories that they were at? Uh, one territory is 
Queen Khalifa's territory. The other territory is Kansas and the land of flowers, then also Illinois, Islam. More is we're the law. Gratitude, Islam. We are the law, and I mean that, and that's the truth. We've Islam. been the law, we are the law, and, and, and we're doing it the lawful way. We are actually meeting as Congress, because we are the Congress, and we're voting on things. This is how government is done. Islam members. Islam, um, so the the national promotion, the red lobster one that we're talking about right now, where mm -hmm. is that on the public record or does that need to be recreated? Uh, we put it under the video previously, but I will put, uh, I'll put it under this video as well. I just put it under the videos and Moors can pull it off and print it and copy it and do whatever and tribute it to whomever. I'm looking there and, and I don't see it, which is yeah, what I, I inquired about it. Uh, okay, let me see. And I may I'll be put, looking. Okay. I'll put it under this video right here as well. Um, with this video, with this um, speaking of which, uh, Empress Angel, uh, where clarification is concerned, uh, with this particular one, this particular program of all food chain restaurants, food stores, retail grocers, and custodians. I'm thinking we may need to add a delarium portion to it. Um, yes. You know, for the sake of accounting. That's really yeah. what I'm thinking about, for the sake of accounting. That way they'll know our money yeah. and it'll get out. Because I'm definitely spread that. Yeah. <laughs> Talk about we, it. Yes. So maybe we add uh, um, more sovereign delarium or or Swiss francs or United States dollars, and more sovereign delarium and Swiss francs are one; they're the same. Okay. Um, should we have to also consider the people? You know, everybody don't have computers where they can print this stuff off and. Um, then they will have to get it from a government, one of you all, <laughs> one yeah. of us. Okay. You know, like the Empress did and like Justice Dawood did, they just made copies of it and gave it out and boom. Well, I guess they beat. could show it to them on their phone. Would that be the same thing? They can do that. They can do that. Okay. okay. They can do that. And that's another reason why, and then just make, they, they'll sign their receipt, and that will be their signature, as we know, is the proof. Okay. Yeah. So uh, maybe, uh, is there, are all in favor of, of maybe putting a delarium, just something on there? Uh, about delarium or Swiss francs or United States dollars. And actually, I would like to keep it very general and, and state that Swiss francs are, I'm sorry, more sovereign delarium, is equal to or is, let me see, more sovereign delarium, Swiss francs and U United States dollars, and when we say United States dollars, we mean our money and not a dead, anything dead, none of that fake stuff, and United States, because this is the national United States. This is not that corporate thing that, that we knew from last era, and national United States dollars are the same or equivalent, the same and equivalent. Lawful money. Uh, the same and equivalent and are, uh, and we actually kind of almost don't have to, uh, we could say that they are products of the treasury, the United States National Treasury. I like that language. Because the more we cast that spell, the more it would be, you know. Yes. 
Yes, United States Treasury. I like that. The ancestors say pay that fiat or groceries you will have not. Oh, let us hear the truth. Pay wow. that fiat or So I think that that, that particular uh, uh, court jester missed his calling because he's not very funny. <laughs> Okay, let me stop. Um, more sovereign delarium, Swiss francs, and national United States dollars are all, uh, let me see. And uh, are one and the same, and our products, uh, not products, I don't want to say products, and our species from the national, from the... The ancestors say, hey, that's the otter. Um, you will have not. Yeah, you're going to get I'm going to have to boot you. Uh, let's see. Just one moment. Um... United, and national United States dollars are one and the same, and our species from the United States Treasury. And actually not from, but for the United States Treasury. Thank you. I almost said that. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Empress. We were We were thinking the same. That's that collective consciousness working together, Islam. And thank you for, for, for speaking on that because, um, you know, we try as we're hearing from the ancestors, we, we, we work on uh, trying to cover everything and put as much in there as possible. But I am so, so, so grateful for this Congress because there are that many more sovereign eyes looking at what we're doing so that we don't miss anything. All right. Islam, Islam. thank you, thank you, thank Islam. you. Islam. Uh, Islam nobility. Um, just for some clarification, um, all the seals on the document, are they, just, are they international seals or just national seals? National is international. Justice Khan Sue, I'm coming over there. In the United Kingdom. That, yes. Um, it looks to me that, you know, it's only for America. I said, no, these are international seals. Each and every one of them. See, the, the thing that they, that, that they did not want us to know is that that's America too. Absolutely. Just because there's some a, a little bit of water in between us, it's still the land. That's why they say across the pond, because they know it's not that much water like what they try and make it seem. Mm -hmm. We're one. So, it, you know, even those more it, at the Congo can use them, and they are honored because they were all eating off of us in the first place, all of us. You know, they were eating off of you all and all of because we're one. So, Islam, yeah. may I add, because if you over, well, because we understand that all corporations got their corporate jurisdiction to do business from here anyway. So, any yeah. corporation doing business earthwide knows that because it started here and everything, you know, emanates outward. <clears throat> They know that they have to fall in line 
and get with the times that we're at and do as commanded. So they know that their their um, EIN numbers and their DUNS numbers came from here. They know that they was corporately doing business because of here. So yeah. that whole thing of, you know, you just got to make it suit for you and command them to do so. Well, let's, 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 let's even take that a little step further. They knew that the land over there is the same land as the land that's over here. They knew that. So they said, well, exactly, yeah. we, have to, we have to do what the Moors everywhere at Earth say. So in the, in the, because we don't do anything in a chaotic manner. Everything that we do is orderly. We are gods for order. Everything is done line upon line, precept upon precept, here and there. So there is not different from here. It's not. And so um, the nine seals you preview, uh, I think it was last year. Mm -hmm. um, where did we get those seals? Uh, state seals. that once again, nobility. Uh, the nine seals that you um, previewed that last year. The nine seals. I cannot understand what you're saying. The what he that I previewed. Oh yes, the nine seals. Okay, okay, I hear that. Yes. How do we? How do we um get them? Um, I will put a link to them. Link to the nine seals under this video Islam. on YouTube. Thank you, Empress. Uh, and just one moment, link to the Red Lobster document as well. Islam nobility. I do. Islam, I thank you. Islam, thank you, thank you, thank you. We're so honored. I can't wait for us to meet in person <laughs> or at person or in Sophia Persona Sue Juris. I like to say in real life. Yes, indeed. Because you know what else is on, on, on our agenda for this year is travel. And uh, the ancestors already showed us how to go into the buildings and begin operating. They showed us that we'll be putting that forth as well. There is a process and it's not a long process, but it has to be done. There is a, a, a it's something like a kind of a ritual almost that we have to do with the flags and things that to get, you know, as we're going into the buildings and the court, the district courthouses and the Supreme court houses and things. And as we begin to sit down and, and, and do our work there. So all of that is on tap for the next 365 days or more. If we could all just be patient and let the process continue to happen. It's happening. Yeah. Yeah. So um, I'm just glad we're at this point. I'm glad we're here at this point that we're at right now, Morris, because we needed to get here and not needed. It was, it was our desire to get here to this point where, where things are manifesting very quickly. We knew we would get to this point. We just wanted to, uh, the ancestors wanted to make sure that at, they were doing energy checks at, with each thing that we stated on the public record. They were doing energy checks just to make sure that as we see how powerful we are, that we use our energy wisely during that time period and continue to treat each other with the utmost respect and, you know, learn from what we're seeing the foreigners, uh, the subjects act out as they exit stage left. Look at it and, and know that, okay, we see that there's division among them. They're scrapping and fighting and, you know, calling it a quote-unquote civil war and all of this and that and a third. We don't participate in war, and they're showing us why we don't do that. 
So all we have to do is keep these mighty pins going, and we'll be all we we good. With that being stated, uh, is there any other uh, wisdom from this grand Congress? Islam. Questions. Islam. I have one last short poem. Islam. Everybody on this call has inspired me to write. May I share it? Yes, please. They are the matriarchs, the ark with the covenant. There is no disagreement. With air under her wings, killing things. Things, things that are crooked, she is making straight. We cannot wait. We cannot wait. It's too late. Let's remove all, all the hate. Islam. Islam. That's very beautiful. Islam. Thank you. We Noah. thank you for your words. Islam. Islam. Gratitude. Islam. You stole yes. the show tonight, brother. Islam. 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 Oh. Islam. And I'm feeling the love for my sisters on this call, too, because we're we're being brought even closer together by his words, by the words of our of our of our patriarch. They said me like you're guilty. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Somebody arguing with their children on the line. Empress. Uh yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. you know, um we're 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 being gratified and 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 made whole even further. Like I said, uh the ancestors have already stated that anytime we think it's really good, it can get better. It's going to get better. Um, Empress Shasha, I wanted to do one clarification on on this uh, credit or customer thing. Yes. Um, did you want the word or customer, and, and are, is this Congress okay with the word or in between those two, or, or leave it the same, or what do you all think, Congress? You know, I, I had that, that, that I wanted it to be clear that mm -hmm. there are two different, two different states and two different people, but then, of course, as you stated, mm -hmm. the, uh, the pen, um, yeah. okay. the feathers and everything else. So I'm, it's yeah. not um, critical, although for the um, store custodians and those... I don't yeah. know. I think it might not be a bad idea to have that distinction, but mm -hmm. it, I'm flexible in that regard. Islam. Uh, is and and or acceptable? Well, you uh, wouldn't be a creditor and a customer. So and or would not, at, at least I don't think, because if you're a creditor and a customer, you cannot mix statuses. That's true. Uh, you can clarify that for me, but I think that there and or and or are two. Are you there? Different. Oh, Empress Shash, are you there? I am. Yes. Oh, okay. I thought we lost you. The, no, the call. Sorry, I, I thought it dropped. Empress was talking though. Um, oh, okay. It's fine. I don't know. Maybe you lost her. She was saying and or. Um. We can say, or this is this is this is this is the goal of what we're doing. To one goal of many, there are many goals. Uh, one of the goals of what we're doing is to continue our emergence. Emergence meaning coming out of of you know, but with as little chaos as possible because we are gods of order. We have the distinction must be made. Now, as the heirs, we can make that distinction clearer by how we present ourselves with turbans, fezes, etc., publicly, and red pens or blue pens. How come you never talk about okay, First so Avenue so anymore, much, Pauline? So um, we can. Um, we want everyone to know that we're back on that we are we're here we never left uh, but we don't want it to be divisive so we want it to be 
known. It's going to be known now. That's going to, that's clear. It's it's known and it's going to continue to be known. But um, and I think war should be in there, to be honest. Where's your sea salt yeah, factory on First Avenue, Polly? We can do that. We can do that. Uh, uh, is there anyone at this Congress who who disagrees with the word or being there by creditor or customer? Islam. Okay. Islam. Islam in person. I have a suggestion. Maybe it'll clear this up. Maybe not. Um, what What about if stupid oh, Negroes? This is a cult. A you moment. stupid Negroes. This is a cult. That's the moment. Oh. Go ahead, Empress. <laughs> so my suggestion um, is to, um, if there's room on the page, I know it's a, a long form, but I don't know how much more room is there. And I don't know if um, what I'm suggesting will take up that much room, but what about a check box? Oh, shit works. Shit doesn't work, A check box. A check box or a line or something of that nature to be able to make the distinction of if, of course, you know, the creditor, red pen, turban, yeah. all of that. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. If, if we want to make a distinction between creditor or customer, what about putting a, a check box or some something like that there so we can so we can make it clear that way? I will I will say that I I think the red pins and the and the turbans and fed and things are enough, are enough uh, cuz what we don't want to do is is get into um we don't want to go into us filling out forms to get our our you know what's ours already you know what I mean? And and when we start after after that signature, if we start getting into the check boxes and all of that, then it it you know it gets to be we put so much on the public record already that that I think that that we just let it let the let the sigils at the top speak for itself. You know, in terms of and our signatures and our presentments and our behavior. Speak for it. So our nobility, and just let that be what it is. That's just my my thoughts on a checkbox. I, I I really don't want to do a checkbox. This <laughs> one, I understand. I was just trying to come up with a, a way to, to make the distinction, since the uh-huh. more want to make a distinction between creditor and customer. I say, I say let's 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 make the distinction in how we present ourselves. Let's just do that. I, I think that's no, you know. You know, I think that to me this feels almost new. It does feel like we're emerging. And I just think that our our kindness, our nobility, and our standing on our square with regard to everything that's going on, I think that's that'll do it. That'll do it. The documents that we put on the public record, uh, these congressional meetings and and assemblies and our courts and all of that. Let's let's take it a step at a time and and just go from there. You know. That's just my uh, my my thoughts on that. I I, I want to minimize the amount of paperwork because we're doing so much already. Islam. Islam. If I may say humbly, I think it's fine where it is. I think we keep going round and round with and slash or. Yeah, yeah. I think it's beautiful. It's working very well. And we're still in the winter months. Yeah. So we, we, I think it's great. Yeah. Great. Uh, I'm just excited that we're demonstrating them. That to me, I, listen, by the time we get off these calls, I'm dancing on the tables around here because I'm like, Islam. Oh, Islam Empress. Um, the um, Red Lobster. Yes. Is not here. Okay. I can use the. You're going to put the coupon underneath. And yes. 
create something local for this territory, having leaned the restaurant or um, and uh, get something going here. Yes, Empress. Please, uh, for those who are at the different territory uh, in terms of uh, the islands and the UK, you all are the government. So anything that, that is put out, you can use it as is. Or if you're led to add a little something to it or, or edit it a little bit, please feel free to do that. Because when we come to your territories, we're going to be using y your stuff. <laughs> yes, if it's Shasha, you know, you're governing there and, you know, just hey, a to, you know, we're coming to eat with y'all too. Amen. So, you know, looking forward to that. Yeah. Canaan land wars, uh, Empress, why not? We coming. So, <laughs> you know, let's, let's, let's do this. Any other comments, questions, wisdom from this amazing, amazing, super amazing Congress? Islam. Islam justice. This is uh, Will Irvin Smith Bay from Mississippi Territory. Yes. I have seen the results of what the Moors have did all over Mississippi. I live in Montgomery County, which is Care County. Mm -hmm. And Care County consists of Grenada County, and Lafoya County. Mm, Islam. And I've been sitting back ever since I started and did my name change, and I thought that's where I was going to go. But what I've heard now is on. Yes. And... If it ought to be, it's up to me. Woo, I have been demonstrating, I have been demonstrating ever since I've been in the world, trying to get the land that belongs to us. Yeah. Not that my little church. Down there in the office has got just a half an acre. But as my research can reveal now, I'm finding this is a thousand one hundred and ten acres. Come on. That includes and the only thing I'm on it is the church and our sacred bear run. Mm. And every bit of it. Belong to my ancestors. I didn't did my yes. family tree. Yes. And I would like to put that on the public record somewhere down the road. Yes. But I'll be 80 years old come the 2nd of March. Yes. But, and when I looked at our Constitution that we are on the now, we put the Mississippi Constitution on the public record. Yes. Yeah. The 1868 Constitution, the only one that was ratified by the Congress and the Senate and the peoples. And it just became public record back here a little while ago. Mm. And the 1890 Constitution it wasn't but one more there. Mm. They couldn't do it without one more. So what I'm asking here, I had some postage stamps, and the delirium have been sent to me, but since I went from one computer to the other, and I got a lot of stuff lost. Mm -hmm. Would somebody please send me some more postage 
and some more delirium. Yes. And I had a brother over in uh, Alabama. Mm-hmm. Alabama and Mississippi both were the Mississippi Territory. Mm-hmm. But Mississippi just come out of the West Mississippi, and Alabama come out of the, the uh, East Mississippi. Yeah. So we all are one. Yeah. And I would like really merge to bring Mississippi yeah. into the United States. Yeah. Because they have even the uh, a mem- member of the United States. States of America. <laughs> the only constitution that they had, they hid it to get back in the union. Mm. Of Mississippi <laughs> don't exist. And I admire all of you that I hear on this call, young people. Yes. Keep them going. This Indian come on here, he ain't nothing but encouragement for me. <laughs> he sent me a text one time, and, and I asked him, I said, why did you all of a sudden get concerned about me? Come on. And by the way, where did you get my phone number from? Oh, I got it off of the call. Mm. I said, well, you get rid of it. <laughs> and told him, what is your name? Since you know mine, and he ain't he ain't bother me no more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's I like I say, I have been demonstrating all of my life, but I was in the wrong jurisdiction. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to appeal something to the Supreme Court now. You sitting on the Supreme Court. Uh oh. That's what I'm saying. And I didn't know it. Mm, mm-hmm. But I'm with you. I'm just an eighty year old baby. Mm. <laughs> I'm just two years old in this. I hadn't heard of the Moors before before a couple of years ago. That's what I was born as. Yes. Yeah. So yes, please, ma'am. somebody, please send me them. Uh, how do I get in contact with Supreme Court? Uh, let me, let me, what, what is it, Justice Willie? How, how would I get in contact with the Supreme Elder Brother in Mississippi? Uh, who, who is, uh, just one moment, let me just, oh, yes, Islam. Um, just one moment, let me, let me, Justice Willie. Um. Mm-hmm. If you, uh, what's your, do you want to, uh, do you have access to the chat, Justice Willie? Yeah. Okay. Well, you, I just want to email that to Okay, yes, go this ahead. This is email. Irvin 51 at live.com. Okay. And that's Irvin 61 at live.com? Irvin five one at live. Oh, fifty one at live. And is Irvin I R V I N or E R V I N? E R V I N. Okay. If I may, E R V I N five one yes. at live dot com. At live dot com. Thank you very much. I have family in Mississippi. I haven't seen him years. Yes, well, everybody got roots in Mississippi. Yes. Yes, yes. indeed. Myself yes, included. Yes. Yes. I'd be oh. willing to bet you every one of you. Yes. yes. Because this was Hare County held more slaves than any other county in the, in the yes. United States. That more. means our ancestors wow. had more slaves than anybody. Oh. That's right. Let's just put that so I done did, I done did the research and I did it on my family tree, the bloodlines and everything, and I got more kin folks around here, all races. Yeah, yeah. All the colors. Islam. So the Moors ain't got no color. We all color. Yeah, Islam, indeed. All right. So I'm There's- ready to raise some of the 
I'm ready to raise some of them from the dead now. I yield. Y'all probably won't hear for them anymore. <laughs> but I'll be on the call. I love it. It's love. I love it. <laughs> Mm-hmm. He said he's ready to raise up from the dead. Get him, Justice Willie. <laughs> Islam, indeed. Uh, yes, so we will send you the postage and the delarium, Justice Willie. Islam, I have uh, Empress Ravana to, to send to forward that to you. Uh, Thank you. I got a question. Okay, uh, just one moment. Uh Empress Aisha, did you do you have a question? Because there's some echoing coming from your line. Empress. I'm sorry, I was mute. I was going to say something, but I got the no, Go ahead. We we, we love hearing from you. Yep. Oh, there you go. Justice Willie, Empress Aisha says she's also from Mississippi. Come on now. My mother was Fort Deposit. She was born at Fort Deposit, Alabama territory. And Alabama, Mississippi, and Georgia, all of those were one at one time. Georgia, Mississippi, the Carolina, all, that was all one territory. And then they continued to retail and chop it up, Islam. Uh, let's... Some of the best watermelons on the planet come from Georgia and Mississippi. It's long. Yes, indeed. All y'all is my cousins. Yes, we are. <laughs> cousins and brothers and sisters at the same time. Islam. I got, I got two nephews in, in Washington, D.C. Really? Islam. B-E-N-A. In Washington State, I mean, man. Islam, indeed. Indeed, indeed. Wait, uh, at. I'm making sure we get everybody. Okay. Well, Moore's great, great, great uh, sovereign, ancient Congress assembled Islam. Uh, With that being stated, I have nothing further for this honorable court. Uh, And if there be nothing further, we will adjourn until. Today is Sunday. We will adjourn until Thursday. And Islam, Islam Empress. Did we finish the discussion about the lien for the grocery stores? Uh, we did finish the grocery stores. We and we also stated that if you if you didn't see any grocery if you if there was a grocery store missing, if you would please place that lien on the public record, because we're all speaking with one voice. Islam. 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 Uh, Islam Empress. Me again. And I just wanted yes. to uh, confirm and clarify that we were finished, at least for now, with this particular document that we had been working on all along. I believe that we are. Uh, is there any, are, is there any, uh, uh, I believe we are for now. Okay. Uh, we are going to revisit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's we have to look over the bottom, that's all. And I just wondered, I know where you were just showing it to us for future, but... Yes. Thank you, Empress. Uh, the bottom part is for... Um, this is for the restaurant store custodian use right. only. Uh, and this is... They could, they could literally perforate this, you know, cut it across. And to be mailed or deposited and um, this is where they send it to Um, United States National Bank 321 Southwest 6th Avenue Portland Oregon but that's but they can they can deposit it at any of their wherever they do their banking they can deposit it there also they are to to put the store name and number the physical street address and store number if if Applic- uh, well, it's, it's going to be a physical one. Um, city and state do not use initials for the state. They are to use, uh, they're to write the state out. And then here, Moore's, uh thank you, Empress Shasha, because I wanted to point this out. We're not talking about 
United uh, the 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 dead postal service zip codes because that's a separate set of zip codes in a different CEDIS trust than post office zip codes. Or we could have said postal code. Okay, so when they when we did those, we called it a post office code post office zip code or a postal code instead of a, a, a United States Postal Service zip code. Okay. Uh, receipt amount for food and then receipt amount for wait staff, 33% gratis. And then adding those two lines together is the total. Um, and we probably should have put that right under here. I'm so glad you said that, Empress. Um, uh, this amount is going to be total mm -hmm, amount for uh, redemption to Uh, to <laughs> restaurant. And the reason I'm saying restaurant is because, believe it or not, Moors, this amount that's going, that, that's going to be coming back is still coming back to our vast estate. It's still not going to, to anything or anyone foreign uh, because we're actually the original IRS also. So we've created that loop that we needed to create. It's a sovereign loop so that there's no interloping and no foreign fiat involved in our systems. So the corruption is, is finished. Shut up. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So with that being stated, P? Question. Uh, yes. In, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Could you put your email in the up under the place so we can get my email. An email. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Thank you. And this email is uh, it is it's it's um it's pretty it, it stays pretty full so. Uh, <laughs> it's fun. One, one, half, one question. Where do I find a website to get my universal postal code? Like the longitude, latitude, for example. Um, I have the lac, the longlat dot net. Yeah. But the actual universal postal code that longitude lat. I've seen they them on the dot. One and the same, wouldn't they? It doesn't express it in the launchlight.net, not the, the actual uh, zip per se. Are zip you talking code. about the natural area code? Uh, is that the same thing? The area code is it? The natural area code. Uh -huh. So this is what the natural area codes look like. Um, I just want to be sure for clarification. Yes. Uh, natural area code would be the NAC listed right here. This is yes. a natural area code. Yes. Is that what you're asking about? Or is Correct. it? Correct. Uh, for natural area code, I am not, uh, you would have to Google it and do some research to find it. Okay. Because the place that I got this one from apparently uh, is not working anymore or something of that nature. I, I, I don't know. Um, some have been having problems accessing it. So, uh, but we, yeah, it, it hopefully one will come back online so that those who want to utilize that will be able to utilize it. Beautiful, beautiful. Thank you so much. Islam, Islam. Islam. I just put a link in the chat and, and the website, I mean, the search engine you have to use in order to use that link. Ah, Islam. Okay, I have a question. Would she repeat that again? Uh, I have to use a search engine? Uh, I'm going to put on the screen 
uh, what the link and and all of that that she that she that she just named. It's right there. She said use DuckDuckGo search engine, and then put in this HTTPS here. This 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 that you see here on the screen. Islam, I Islam. found that on the app on the Play Store. You did? Indeed. Okay. Um, let's see. So this is going to be for... This is for natural area code. And this link uh, and this information that Empress uh, Karima put on there or just gave to us in the chat will be under this video as well. I have a question. It's Sister Rose Rosetta. I'm sorry. Empress Rosetta. I apologize. Thank you for correcting me, Islam. Islam. Yes, Empress. Yes, um, I want to ask, um, where do I get the video for the DeLorean? Uh, it's at Light to Jerry Bay on YouTube, Light to Jerry Bay channel on YouTube, uh, and I can put that link. Uh, can someone put the link to my channel on YouTube in the chat, please? I, if I start going, it's going to show everything that I put on my screen, and I don't want to go through all of that. Um, Islam, Islam, I've got her. I've got Thank her. you. She's got Thank two you. wings helping her too, so Thank bird you. needs two wings to fly. Islam. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Islam. Islam. Um, could you state your WhatsApp number, please? It is 334-294-9900. Thank you much. Yes, you're welcome. So, so this natural area code that you put here, we, can you use that in any state, or we have to go to our own state to find our own? Uh, you, you, uh, normally with natural area code, you put in your the address, and it will pull up a natural area code for that. Wherever okay. you put that, yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. And and for those who are not familiar with natural area codes, the natural area code system that we were using initially, um, that system, the natural area code system is so precise that the natural area code for my li the living room is different from the kitchen and the one for the bedrooms is different from both of those rooms. They're, they're that specific down to like the inch. So I understand why it's called a natural area code. And no two are the same on the planet. So you can, you can go right to exactly what room someone was in when they picked that natural area code. It's a very precise system that our ancestors put in place since time immemorial. The entire earth is mapped already, and there's a system where if you only used the natural area code, you would still know where someone in China was or someone in Japan or Greenland or Antarctica or wherever. Our ancestors know everything. They are very precise. Make no mistake about it. This is not an accident. With that being stated, uh, was there someone else that, wanted, that had something that they wanted to either state or ask? Islam, um, Islam, so we're going to vote on this at the next congressional meeting. Vote, and I, vote. To, Hold on. To, this document here, or do we state that already for the record that it's a unanimous passing and it's enacted? Uh, this is this document is under the same program. Oh, okay. So all it's right, under the food program. It's the same mm -hmm. language that's in the uh, the Red Lobster document. All right, so exactly. So and this will did, be under the document. I mean, under the video at the end 
Um, maybe yeah. Thursday. I mean tomorrow. Uh, yes, it'll be it'll be under this video. I should have it up by tonight. Okay. It should be up tonight. And then uh, more is as you go out and demonstrate, just you know your 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 most noble energy is is appreciated by the government, which is you. With that being stated, peace. Thank you for all you do. Thank you too so much. I'm I'm just honored to be in unity with this great and awesome Congress. Peace and grand rising to all the sovereign, original, indigenous, natural, divine heirs, Islam. Peace. Islam. Peace and grand rising. Peace and grand rising. Peace and grand rising. Peace and grand rising. Islam. Grand rising, Moors. Islam. Grand rising. Islam. Grand rising. Grand rising, Empress. Okay. Okay. You back there? Islam. And we will end in five, four, three, two, one. Peace.